Hello everybody, welcome to the Champions League watch along. Didn't know if I was going to do one, uh, I, I, felt, I felt up for it, so we are here. Um, it's Real Madrid, it's Man City, it's the European Titanic clash of the century. Well, it certainly has been in the past few years anyway. This has been a rivalry that's been brewing for the past few years. Ike Casillas himself said that in his opinion, it's replaced Real Madrid versus Bayern Munich, uh, it's a big game, obviously, um, at the Bernabeu, uh, scary ground. In fact, it's so terrifying that David Silva, who normally occupies this area here on my wall, actually fell off the wall. Um, so, yeah, that, that, that's that's a bad omen, so I'm going to have to figure out how to prop him back up, because he's, he's attached to the wall via a magnet, so I'm going to have to figure out how to do that. But guys, get your thoughts in the chat, get your score predictions in the chat, uh, right here, right here. Now, uh, KX has subscribed on Twitch for five months in a row. We've activated the Hall and Prince if he wants to if he wants to print. There we go, Erling. Good work. Thank you so much for that, KX. You lovely, lovely man with your. I don't think that's what you look like, KX. I don't think you're a Madison Beer impersonator, but you look lovely nevertheless. So thank you so much, KX, for choosing to use your Twitch subscription on me. We love to see that. Thank you so much for the support. That really does help me out. It's massive. Uh, John. Hello, John. Love to see the same faces, by the way, for these watch-alongs. Uh, love your support, guys. Uh, John says, come on. Uh, Andre says, big nobbins. I'm calling a 2-1 win for us. The lineup is good. We'll get into that lineup. Schumann, we're a centre-half. We're going to cook. He's been playing there a, a bit this season, to be fair. Um, uh, hello, Scorpio. Uh, come on, the boys, says John. I'm not ginger. Uh, hello, Shaking. How about you, says Drumroll. Genuinely, um... Like, obviously, I want to win, of course. Like, that'd be stupid to not say it, but I'm not... I, as I sit here now, I have no nerves. And that's not, like, an arrogance thing. It's, like, we've won it now, and we've won the trip. Like, it's done, you know? I, I got terrible... Um, I got terrible nerves, you know, like, in, like, the uh, seasons prior. But now that we've actually done it, never mind uh, with, with, with the treble... Um, Oh, look, obviously, I want us to win, but you get, I, I don't feel like, I, I don't feel that nervous, to be honest. Uh, it's going to be no, no draw, says Darshan. I'm going to say it will be low scoring. Um, Your mic is anus. What does that mean, village? Are we having audio issues, guys? 
Can you guys uh, confirm that for me? Thank you. Um, yeah, it's going to be low scoring, that's for sure. Uh, hoovered up two lines up. Wait, what? <laughs> um, uh, yeah, alas, that KX. Uh, hello, Josh. Uh, Woman chat some chilling on LB streams. Come on, City. No worries at all, Josh. Uh, one all, so seven letters. 2 0 to Madrid. Oh, gosh, I hope you're wrong. Uh, we're going to crumble that roof with goals. Uh, City 4, Real Madrid 2. I don't think it's going to be that high scoring, to be honest. Uh, yeah, as I say, Jerome, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not chilling. Uh, Shub KX. Uh, what I want to on City, what's going to happen, one all. Yeah, for me, it's going to be a low-scoring draw, I think. Uh, hello, Bree, who says, uh, 2-2, two, two, lovely. Uh, watching, yes, I'm also watching on that, Mohamed. I've got Arsenal to tell me if the City game is good. I will, KX, if you want to keep me updated on the Arsenal game, you go for it. Um, gonna go to all this drum roll. De Bruyne isn't playing because he is ill. He's on the mic, but he's uh, on the mic. He's on the bench, but he's ill. Yeah, what's this mean, Village? Let, let me know if there are any audio issues. Uh, what stuff on Twitter? Uh, Tom. How do you not have nerves? Uh, oh, thank you so much again, Jack, for subscribing for six months in a row. You've activated the hype train. <laughs> thank you so much, Jack. Incredibly generous. Uh, open to an ad. Wasn't happy about it. <laughs> Thank you so much, Jack. You lovely man. If anyone else wants to subscribe on Twitch to keep the hype train going, you're more than welcome to. There is no pressure to do so, obviously. It KDB to be a sick, guys. Uh, he's on the bench, so hopefully. 4-0, 1-all, 3-1. Uh, shout out, Jack, for the subscription. There is no Edison. Yeah, big up to you, Muha. Um, we'd love to come away with at least one goal in our favour. Crevice says, come on, City. And let's actually have a look at the lineup. Because, again, people have been asking about... I mean, Stuff says, I like this lineup. This is... With, with, with the injury situation we have, this is the best lineup. And it's not really a question. De Bruyne is unwell. So he couldn't start. So that got rid of the question of... You know, is it going to be Kovacic, Bernardo, De Bruyne, Foden, Grealish? No, there is no there is no debate. This had to be the team. Gavardio being available, he he has to be playing. If Rico Lewis was playing, that would be a bit of an issue. Not necessarily because of Lewis, but more so the dynamics of the rest of the defence. Gavardio being fit, or, so, or certainly starting anyway, is huge. It does mean that we are likely going to see Foden take up the mantle of the De Bruyne midfield, um, which is massive. Of course it is. Uh, massive, massive opportunity for him. He's got, he's got to turn up. To be honest, he's got to perform. Um, he's got to have a good game. There is no De Bruyne. As I say, he is on the bench. But there might be a, a silver lining. There's a silver lining in that De Bruyne is not available. But it does mean that we start Kovacic, and um, it means that we start Kovacic. Which means control, control, control. Grealish and Kova for me. This game, and, and if we get past the quarterfinals, whoever we play in the semi-final, those are the two games where I want to see uh, maximum control utilised. Um, so I'm very happy with the lineup. to be fair. De Bruyne's on the bench, Doku's on the bench, Alvarez, um, maybe Bob Lewis if you want to bring them on, but we do have some, we do have some impact off the bench as well. Just looking at Real Madrid's bench, Brahim Diaz, ex-City player, Tobias. Oh, Militao is fit enough to be on the bench, okay. But outside of that, there's not too many uh, impact options for them. Uh, they, uh, they have got, uh, got there. Probably like their, their strongest starting 11, given the uh, fitness and injury concerns. Um, but guys, it's a good team from City. As I say, there is no De Bruyne starting. Not ideal, but silver linings. Let's let's try to look at the positives. It means Greek, it means Kova starts. Control. It means Real Madrid. It means Real Madrid starts. It means Foden starts in his preferred position. Hopefully, if I see Foden on that right side and Bernardo in the middle, I don't know what I'm gonna. I don't know what I'm gonna do. But you you would assume it would be Foden central, um, his best position as we all know. And he's got to turn up. He's got to turn. He turned up in the Champions League final. It was fantastic when he came on for De Bruyne. This is a, another sort of like metaphorical passing of the mantle situation. The yellow cards is also interesting. Ruben Diaz for City. We can't afford for him to be suspended for the next game given our injury concerns. But also, Real, four of Real Madrid's better players are all on yellows. Uh, Vinicius, Bellingham, Chouamini, Camavinga. If any of them get a yellow card in this game, they miss the next uh, leg. That would be huge. That would be huge if any of them got booked. 7-0 to City. Oh my gosh. Um... I got some Cheetos, cake and cola. Love that from you, DR. 
Uh, Justin Havertz is playing for Arsenal. Might switch games. Uh, I asked what, what was going on on Twitter, Tom. What was going on? Uh, reckon 2 all says Riven. Hoping for a win at the Etihad. Uh, I mean, DR, if you don't want spoilers, go to... Oh, we've kicked off. Go to the YouTube, mate, because you can pause it there. Uh, we've kicked off. I, I, I missed that. Um, one of their players gets yellow. Oh, but Omar, they, they will obviously know it more than anyone else. So they will obviously be as careful as they can be. My audio on my TV is very quiet. So I'm just going to turn this up. And uh, immediately, Vinicius trying to cause some havoc. City able to deal with it. Deal with it there. That's a lovely take by Jack Grealish. Already, this is quite... I know we're only 30 seconds in, but I'm surprised at how open... That oh, yellow! Give him a yellow card! Isn't that Chumini? Or is that, that Kamavinga who's just got booked? Who's, who's just got booked there? Oh! Chumini's been booked! He misses the second leg! Huge from Jack Grealish! Oh! Big, big... Big. I'm celebrating that like a goal's been scored. Well, that is huge. That means he misses the second leg. What an idiot. And that is why you start Jack Grealish, guys. And Omar's prediction has already come into play. And that means he misses the second leg already. Boom. Misses the next game. Massive. Oh, yeah. I'm no, I, don't know what, I don't know what that's all about, to be honest. Uh, Can you? I didn't know you could do that. Liam says, I want to watch Arsenal. I can't not watch City Madrid. Massive dilemma. I mean, if this game starts to pop off, Liam, then I could... Then you'll also know by my reaction, you know how to switch. You know how to switch. You say calm down. That's big. That is big. They've already got like a, a, a centre-back issue at the moment. So him not being available is big. Jack was a foul speed run. Yeah, exactly. And, and, exactly, and it was a yellow. Yeah, I totally agree with that, Jack. It's, it should be irrelevant when a challenge comes in. Fuck all on! What a booty goalkeeper you are! You conceded that! Yeah, hold that! Hold that, old man! Take it! Where's that come from? The perfect start, ladies and gentlemen. How have you let Bernardo score a free kick? What is the goalkeeper's positioning? He's caught unawares. It's a masterclass from Bernardo Silva. That is ridiculous. That is so funny, man. The perfect start. Chumini misses the next game. Bernardo Silva, Bernardo Silva scores early. And I'll, I don't know if I revealed this, guys, but I'll be more than happy with a draw. More than happy with a draw today. If we can take a draw back to the Etihad and, and back ourselves to win. That's big. That is big. There we go. Ma oh my. Well, that is per that's perfect because Real Madrid for like the whole fucking, the whole like past like few days have been like going, um, uh, they've been going, oh, we want to, everyone come, in, come dressed in white and we'll do the stadium thing. So that was big for City to try to, try anyway, as it, Vinicius Jr. misplaces that, try to uh, quell, try to quell the stadium. Bernardo Silva loves the goal against Real Madrid. How many has he got now? He got two last season, didn't he? Has he ever got any prior? I don't know. This guy. Just, that was just like a fuck it. I'm just going to... I, this this idiot's office. This idiot's just not. This idiot's just not, not in the right position. Silence the roof, says John. Messi, the Argentine banana silver, big up. And this is going to be the danger, as that is a throw in to City. They've shot in the bed early on entirely already. And that, and, and as I say, that is really funny. The way, uh, look, anything can happen. Maybe City lose this game 4 1. But the fact that for like the past week they've been going about, we want, you know, in fact, I saw somewhere that it's the first ever sellout or something. Like Real Madrid Extra tweeted it and then they updated their tweets. I think they've got a bit embarrassed. It's, it's something like this. Is like That's the, the UCL done. Is, is this the most attended like a uh, game at the Bernabeu? Um, and oh, here's Vinicius. Kanji's got a big job today, a big job. Yeah, and, and the roof situation, everyone coming white, and then that happens. It's qu it's quite funny. It is quite funny. As I say, there's still nearly 180 minutes of football to be played. Anything can happen, but you can't deny, from a City perspective, that is beyond the perfect start.
It's not a foul on Bellingham. He to oh, it, that was the sense referee. He did that. Bellingham did that. You should book him for that, I reckon. A stronger referee books Jude Bellingham there. Makes him miss the next game, I reckon. VAR? Can we have VAR, please? Thank you. That is descent. That is be showing aggression to the referee. If this was a basketball game, that would be a technical foul. Uh, why is Roger giving away the ball? Um, now, now Real Madrid are coming forwards. I'm not a fan of this. We'll prevent the shot then. There we go. Easy clearance. Oh my. Vardiol pumps it against Vinicius. Mm. Well, there you go. It's the most attended then. Smashed it. Uh, Bernardo just loves these games. Uh, hope you get to the semis. Give me that fixture pile up, says Liam. Uh, they're rattled, says John. I'm watching Warriors Lakers. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be watching any basketball tonight. Look at that. Vinicius having to get the, the crowd up. Allow it, Tab. Allow it. God, look at how much space there is. What? Oh my God, that's incredibly risky from Real Madrid. They, they've just let Rudiger be in a 1v1 with uh, Haaland. That's a fact. I'm sorry, but that's a yellow card on Foden as well by Cruz. Referee, could you... Uh, you can use the yellow card more than once. So much space here for Gavardiol. Plays into Haaland. He's in the Real Madrid box. Takes to shot it. Did I hit the post? Oh, Grealish has won it back. Jack Grealish, please. Oh my God. What a block. Oh my God. This is chaotic. What is happening? Oh dear. Oh, Ruben Diaz, what are you doing? Oh my God. He did so well there. He did so shit. And then he did so well. Oh my word. He definitely won the ball. You're going to have to get up, you little bitch boy. Yeah. Get up, you little bitch. That's what I thought. Pissing me off. Tenning is injured. Get up. Uh, how many have got home? How, how have we scored? Alan from a bizarre free kick situation. They are, they, yeah, they, they, so far, they have set up to fail. So far. Uh. City could have, City could be 2 0 up. Uh, craziness. Craziness so far from Real Madrid. Uh, long may it continue, to be honest with you. If I'm being honest, and I think I am, long may it continue. Hmm. It's a good point, Nan. Yeah, 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 yeah. There is, there is, the, there is the threat of that. Let's do it. Not much pressure on John Stones here. He's got all the time, all the time, but didn't play the right ball into Bernard. Arsenal almost scored a goal. Almost isn't good enough. Yeah? Yeah. Um, Craziness. Craziness, however, is good. Mad. Didn't they have lanky Belgium twatting goal last season? Yes, they did, Tom. There is no Courtois. He is out. Um, he's been out for the uh, uh, all season. Uh, ACL, was it? Something like that. But apparently, I, I, I can't claim to watch Real Madrid every single week. I watched them a, bit, a fair bit at the start of the season, much less recently. Apparently, their goalkeeper has been very, very, very good this season. Like, very good. So, not necessarily an issue with him being in goal. That being said, suspect positioning for the first goal. Hopefully, the second goal for Man City. They were nowhere near scoring. Martinelli shot from 20 yards and they went miles wide. Why is Kicks lying to me? That's going to be another throw-in. Can't stop. No one can stop Bernard's, Tom. No one. But no one can. It was a chance before. Holland took the shot. It was, a, it was a save, actually. Then Rudiger, yeah, just Rudiger totally got the uh, the clearance wrong. He thought he had more time and space. He didn't. Grealish picked it up. Tried to get a goal himself. Don't like how much... Uh, there we go. We need a we need a good game from Akanji and Diaz in particular tonight, I feel like, with Vinicius and Bellingham running at them. Those are the two main danger men. Why is he should that time so quick? I don't know him. Oh, it's because there's less... Uh, it's something to do with, like... I think the quality on YouTube is technically slightly worse. Therefore, the amount of bit rate is lower. Therefore, there's less of a delay. Something like that. Not 100%. It's something like that. Uh, England women going 2-0. Big up the England. Big up the Lionesses. Hear us roar. Yeah. Nine minutes in. A perfect start for City so far. Uh... Real Madrid have looked half-threatening when Vinicius has been allowed to run, but... But yeah, th this is a... I mean, per obviously a perfect first goal, but it, it, how we're playing right now, this is how we need to play. Just control, measure, try to frustrate Real Madrid, to be honest. Don't allow any stupid counter-attacks. Do not give the ball away in stupid areas. Always play the safest pass. That We don't... We don't need to... From this point, we don't need to score another goal, yeah? I'm not saying that we only can't, but you get me. 
try to frustrate them, force them to overcommit, maybe force them into a few fouls, you know, particularly for certain players. And that Kovacic, I didn't like that pass. You nearly sold Foden a, a, dust, a dud pass then. Thankfully, you got away with it. Made, you ma made the magnet lose its strength, potentially. If you're watching on the Twitch, there are two. Our Foden tried his trademark turn, but it was well read by Tony Cruz. This is where we've got to we've got to snuff them immediately. Like, there we go. Well read by John. They tried to get Vinicius in. A combination of Akanji and Stones were like, nope, we are not doing that. We are not doing that. I'm, I'm, I'm comfortable with our right side defensively. Stones and Akanji, pro when, when fit, have been, probably been our two best... Quadri nearly. Probably been our two best defenders this season. It's more so if Diaz chooses to target... Um, if Diaz chooses to target... Sorry, Bellingham chooses to target... Diaz. Rodri has given away the ball again. That's the second time now. That's upsetting me. It's supposed to be controlled. Let's not have another Crystal Palace performance. Hello, Jeffrey. How we doing, mate? Uh, get yourself down to Costco. Cop something called pistachio cream. Can you send me some? Uh, looking solid reading Madrid's attack so far. Says Riven, 100%. Yes, it's, it's, it's a good start. It's a lovely start. And as I say, long may it continue. Look how deep Jack Grealish is to read the, the movement of Carver Howell. He's going to, again, a lot of defensive burden today. A sack of goal. Is that what? Already it's 1 0. The two English sides are 1 0 up. Rodrigo ghosting to the left. I already miss Edison, says the stuff. I'm sure he'll be back soon. Just got to, uh, got to chill out and deal with these attacks, yes? Uh, you want you booked? Yes, don't we all, Tom? Don't we all? We've already got one of them booked, Chumini. That's lovely. It would be great if we could get Bellingham or uh, Vinicius booked. It's doubtful. Can I think with the shot? And it's oh, it's deflected in. That's so unfortunate, man. <laughs> oh, you lucky, lucky boys. You lucky, lucky boys. It took a massive deflection. And they're back in it. That's such a shame. Bellingham choking out Camavinga there. Massive deflection. There's nothing you can really do about that, I think. Um, we'll have a look, see if our players could get out out to them. But let's have a look. So Camavinga... No, yeah, it's just like there's nothing you can do about that. I just It takes a ridiculous deflection off Ruben Diaz. That's just unfortunate. Yeah, no, uh, incredibly lucky. Uh, undeserved goal, but it happens, sadly. That is the game of football. There we go. What a shame. My reactions are posh. Thank you, mate. Our goal is a bit strange. Well, no, it was it was taking advantage of bad positioning, Nan. It was taking advantage of bad positioning. Uh, it, it was it was just taking advantage of like a mistake. That's just like I, I don't really know what you can do about that. Like sometimes a deflection is a deflection. Why, it's just a glass. Hello? Gonna be a few goals today. That surprised me because I, I I thought I, I I still don't know if there's gonna be a lot of goals. I still think it, it, this should be a tight game. Good evening, Gasky. Use your prime on me if you haven't already, you little rat bag. That's my IRL friend, by the way. But, you know, I don't treat everyone like that, just him. That's lovely from Cover. Foden finding Jack. This is a, yes, this is a, a frantic start. And easily saved by the keeper. Capri Suns haven't had them in years, Liam Byrne. Haven't had them in years. Was that Arsenal goal offside in the end, or did it count? Wait, what? How, how are Real Madrid in? What's happened here? Wait, we're, we're, we're losing. How? What? What are we doing? What are we doing, guys? We we we've 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 thrown we've thrown away the lead in two minutes. This, this isn't 2021 anymore, guys. Or whenever it was, we did that. What on earth happened there? Oh, Kanji, switch on, bro. Huh. And that's why we need Kyle Walker. Sadly, the Kanji couldn't catch up. And then it's another deflection. Are you fucking kidding me?
two deflected goals in two minutes. Like... We shouldn't have allowed it to get to that position, but I've... But... Uh, well, that was elation gone immediately. Well, guys, there's apparently going to be a lot of goals in this game. Unreal. Already three. What? Okay. Okay. It is crazy. I've, I've no idea. Yeah, you're quite right. I've no idea why we were so high high there in respect of our line. I thought we were going to be more defensively, like, compact and rigid given there's no Kyle Walker. If Walker's there, then it doesn't matter because he's got the pace to get back. But we're dealing with... Uh, a kanji out there who's still very good but he's, you don't want him to be like defending the space like that I don't understand that when we went 1-0 up why didn't we just like just absolutely camp and chill out and just like be measured and controlled on the ball we've done the exact opposite now and now there's a risk that the game's going to run away from us City are sloppy they are but I, I, I don't really know why I don't know what's going on incredibly unusual situation uh, is what we're in right now. Interesting. If I mean, Ramage will keep giving us chances, I suppose, but I just didn't think it was going to be this open. I thought it was going to be tight. And uh, I thought it was going to be like tight and measured and controlled. Half time for Lioness is big them up. Uh, I mean, De Bruyne, De Bruyne is not really relevant right, right now. What's relevant is the fact that our defense is getting too easily red here with like long balls over the top I, I i i would have hoped we would have set up to obviously circumvent that because that, that's the only real threat Real Madrid were going to offer us but we've decided to not uh do that we've decided to play a high line again i, I just don't get that hopefully we can sort it out who's a fault for the second goal i need to look at it again but it, it looks like I, I i question like john stones being sucked into i just question the whole defensive line to be honest and, oh, Bernardo misread that horribly. Yeah, that's a bad ball. There we go. Back to City. Sort it. Can I kill you? No, I can't, Tom. Yeah, we, 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 just sh we shouldn't have been set up like that. Because it was just one basic ball, and then Rodrigo was in. Like, what? <sighs> If you're ever in a situation where you can't be offside because the run originates from your own half, then there's something wrong with your defensive line. <laughs> Clearly. Uh, one all buy-in, really? Really? Still more goals in this, says John, 100%. Look, a one-goal loss wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. I still want... Uh, no, yeah, a one-goal loss. I still want to draw. I don't even necessarily want to win. Or, or I feel like we need to win. We don't desperately need to draw, but we do need to not lose by more than one. That's un that's 100%. That's lovely by John Stone. See if he can keep that in, but he's not able to. That was a goal kick anyway. If I go back to the, if I could change channel and go to the Arsenal game. There you go. Yeah, Gnabry has scored. Crazy. Crazy. It's crazy, guys. I've already had three goals. Goodness me. Once again, like, I feel like it's one ball, and like they've and now they've got a shot on our goal. Where's our midfield? Let's chill out, guys. Let's reset. Back off a bit. And if they have the ball, as I say, let's back off. If we have the ball, we can probably create some chances, but let's calm down. Uh, Paul Holland. Oh, Fo Foden's there. I haven't seen him yet. Rodri needs to get his passing sorted. Yeah, Alan. I mean, we won the lot, mate. Crazy game so far. Rodri into Kovacic. Again, I, I need... I don't want to see Rodri on the ball. Second City Saint, thank you so much for the super chat, mate. Thank you for activating Eevee and my Fraudiola filter. Uh... Uh, this is on Pep and his ego of a high line. So second city. So I, I I don't disagree with you. That's exactly what that second goal was. There was no need to concede that goal. Um, it's just cra just crazy. I mean the the first goal is like 
you know, it's a deflection. That It's like, I don't even know what you can do about that, to be honest. Like, you can close him down, but then you're creating space for other people. So, I, I don't know how much you can do with that. The second goal, again, it, it's deflected, sadly. But in terms of getting to that point, yeah, it's a... That's a bad ball, Ruben. Come on. Uh, it's not... Um, it, it, we were just, like, yeah, set up badly there. I, I agree. Thank you so much for the super chat. Second, City Saint, you're always incredibly generous, mate. I genuinely... That genuinely means the world. Anyone in Super Chats, uh, you are beautiful, beautiful people. Uh, can we nullify Bellingham of Vinicius? We haven't done that yet. We've sort of been playing into their hands a little bit, which is unusual. On John, back to the keeper. Easy, easy. There we go. Aliens games, deflections. Oh, I know, mate. I know. The whole point, like I said, was to dominate control, and we're not doing that. I agree. Uh, we're going to be cooked, says Noob King. Well, 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 Real Madrid now, I'm sure they will just want to counter-attack us because they've, because somehow we've given them the lead and we're, I'm about to see the Gnabry equaliser. Oh, where's Arsenal's midfield and defence? Yeah, that is really poor from them. It's a good finish. That is poor from Arsenal. That is poor from the arse, from a team who's so solid defensively. Right, come on, Super Jack. I still, I still think there will be chances for City. That I think we can score one more goal. The question is just, will we concede another? I'd be very happy with a two-all scoreline. Very happy. If we, if that could happen, that would be nice. Maybe another couple bookings. It's one-all in the Arsenal game, Allen. Uh, Arsenal went 1-0 up early. And they equalised. I'm very surprised how many goals there are. Find fans are meant to be banned. There's so many of them in the home end. <laughs> Will they get, like, you know, taken away by the steward? I don't know how that works. John, that's not the ball. We are forcing the issue at the moment, and we really don't need to be doing that. And once again, they're just going to hit us on... They're just going to try to kill us on the counter. We need to be real... If we're passing the ball around in our own defensive third, we need to be very, very conservative. We can only really afford to lose the ball in enemy territory deep. Uh, it was, says Jack. What does that mean? Wait, has it been given as a Diaz own goal? Oh my god, it actually has. Oh, right. That's how big the... So the shot wasn't even on target. Oh my god. That's good by Foden. And then Rodri again. You are having a bad game so far, Sonny. A bad game. Sort yourself out, Rodders. Come on. Bernardo wins it back from Vinicius. Good work. Come on, Rodri. Needed to sort yourself out. I bet foot mob's been given it as a Diaz own goal. So, I mean, how, how unlucky can you get? And again, they shouldn't have got to that position for the... Uh, they shouldn't have got to that position for the second goal. But it was, in, it was incredibly unlucky for Ortega. He can't do anything when it's deflected like that. City sloppy in possession around defensive third. Seen that story a few times this season, exactly. Yeah, we need it in these areas here. But release it, Rodri. There we go. Now, come on. I want Jack on, uh, on Carvajal. That was a good matchup last season. Uh, Jack intercepted by Cruz. That's a bad ball. I guess they can... Uh, well, I guess they must have made a decision because they've decided it's an own goal. They must have made that decision. Edson's on the bench. Maybe he's still not fully fit or fully sharp. I don't know. I simply do not know. Goncova into Rodders. Let's get some corners, guys. We're always good at scoring from those, I reckon. <laughs> it's early days. It's the first half. We just... Losing by two would be unacceptable. Losing by one wouldn't be ideal, but it, we can make it work. A draw is the preferred and realistic scenario for me. We can realistically get something from this game in, in respect of a draw. This first time since the first Villa game, it feels like City being outplayed. I, again, I, 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 don't, I don't know if I agree there. Um, the, the, uh, the, at the end of the day, there were two very weird deflected goals. I personally don't feel like we're being outplayed at all. I think we're vulnerable in transition, but that's not the same thing. We sadly gifted them uh, a route into the game when we didn't have to do that at all. 
Like the Aston Villa game was to the Aston Villa game was just like domination from like minute one. That was like totally different. Uh, yeah, I did nah, and it's odd, isn't it? But yeah, like Rodrigo does well here, and like, but like, when it gets to that stage, it's it's just like the goal shouldn't happen. Like like nine nine times out of a hundred, the goal doesn't happen, but it happens to deflect off a of Kanji in that moment, and it's just uh, unfortunate. But we do have to switch on a little bit in terms of the transition. That's what I'm most annoyed about. And in fact, the second goal wasn't even a transition. It was just really high line. Should Alvarez a man who played midfield? No. No, 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 no. This is fine. This is the lineup. We just need to get a bit of a grip. Rodri needs to stop misplacing passes. And then I'll be a happy lad. Uh, uh, uh. Again, Camavinga, so much space for him. And this is with an errant shot. Uh, goal kick. Roger beats and runs in stasis. Natash, maybe. Hey, maybe, Natash. It could be a thing. Stress is a U shape. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not stressed. I'm chilling. I'm chilling. Uh, I'd be, I'd be annoyed if we don't win. If, sorry, if we lose, but. Oh, Ortega, that is, uh, that is poor. Uh, thank you so much, Alan. Yeah, uh, it's, it's, it's a long journey. I definitely need to be more consistent. I know, I know that with my videos. Um, but I just like to make sure they are high quality. So I, I'm, I'm glad you guys are enjoying the content. Uh, yeah, shout out to anyone who supports me. Love you all. Madrid, uh, not very light on pace, says John. That's another throw in. Well, not able to control that. Haven't seen enough of Holland or Foden yet in the game. Uh, hope De Bruyne can be used as an impact. So yeah, well, he was apparently unwell. He was apparently unwell. I probably could do more shots. And yeah, I just don't really like shorts. That's all. So simply don't sleep. It's a good point, Nan. I'll, I'll work on that. I'll get on that, mate. I want to make the next video one like why Grealish is like really good for City, but if this game, if this is like a loss, I'm gonna have to make another video. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, again, Real Madrid on their left. I don't know why we're like giving Bellingham so much time on the ball. Same with likewise with Vinicius. KB and would be like the Michael Jordan flu game. I don't know what that means. Gavardio slips. Real Madrid force back. Yeah, a lot of uh, possession here for Real Madrid. Not going anywhere yet. The out of possession shape's been fine so far. Just feel like when they pull the trigger, can we deal with that? As we did there, good intercept by Gavardio, but Kovacic had to release it quicker because we could have had a good counter attack there, Kova. Instead, we've, we've won a nothing free kick. Are we playing the fans with it with the flu? Ah, Faz. Did he pop off? Is Kane playing today? I assume he is, Tom. Whoever I'd say we have low key no midfield. It does seem that way, doesn't it? We are sort of getting a little certainly when Real Madrid have the ball, we are getting a little bit outnumbered. Los Blancos. Yeah, the game has slowed uh, has calmed down a bit since that uh, third goal overall in the game. But you are losing City, so you are going to have to uh, come forward a little bit, a little wee bit. We're, we're now pl we're now playing how we should have been playing at one all. Miss Calvin Phillips. <laughs> yeah, can we bring him on, guys? Oh, Stones, that's not. The oh my God, what is that? Somehow we've got away with it. I know we haven't. We've given it away. Yeah, let's uh, let's calm down, guys. Maybe we don't give Foden the ball then when he's got Jude Bellingham right next to him. Somehow we got away with it, but and then Bellingham gave it away. So thankfully, it didn't matter. But so shit, so it's not. It's not been enthralling so far. Uh, can we bring on Pep? 
penalty to buy in, says John. Is, is that so? Is that a thing? Is that actually a thing? I'm going to change the channel. Oh my god, it is a penalty to buy in. I've turned the channel. I'm watching Harry Kane, who might be about to score at the Emirates. Oh wow, I'm now watching Arsenal, guys. Just for like the next minute. Just while they take this penalty. Crazy, crazy. Can Harry Kane make it so... Bo I mean, both English sides led in the opening minutes. Can Harry Kane make it so both English sides are losing as things stand? Kane against Raya. Raya, whatever his name is. Come on, Harry Kane, hurry up. I want to switch over to the City game. There we go. Harry Kane does a stupid little breath thing. Is he going to bottle it like against France? No, it's a simple enough penalty. And there you go. They are winning 2-1. Madness. Madness. Uh, I've now got the Real Madrid game back on. And yeah, sadly, because we just gifted them two goals, all Real Madrid need to do now is get everyone behind the ball, as they are doing, and then counter on us. It's such, it's such an annoying position to be in that we've played ourselves into for zero reason. Really unfortunate, man. Bring on David Pizarro. Do you remember him, guys? I was so excited when we signed him on loan and then he ended up doing, like, shit all. I think he scored one goal in, like, the League Cup or something. He has, Jack. Yes, he scored the penalty. Don't go in quarters. That, that's the rule, John. Yes, clearly. Clearly, that, that's where we went wrong. Oh, and they are triggering a press here. Good work, Edison. Not the best ball. Sorry, Ortega, not the best ball, but Gavardio made it work. Oh, that's risky. Foden makes it work. Good. Back to Stones. Into a little feel. Feel in the middle. Need some runners. Need some help. Here's Kova into Rodders. Jack. Arsenal's position is a lot worse. I mean, to be fair, they're playing the home leg. You, you know, you need to ideally do as good as you can in your home leg. Into Jack Grealish. Oh, that was such good play, but then it's a really good block. Again, Jack Grealish is being blocked twice now. And here, and here guys, this is going to be the story of the game now. Just non-stop counter-attacks. Here's Stones up against Vinicius. V Ruben Diaz, sorry. The shot comes in. Oh my god, I thought that was in from Rodrigo. It's over. Goodness me. That's that's what this game is going to be now, guys. Just City try to City attack. Uh, Real Madrid try to counter-attack as quickly as possible. Goodness me. Thankfully, it's a terrible shot. But there we go. We've signed a curse on Jim. Yeah, Jack. <laughs> it's such a shame, man. Ha... Uh... Oh, Holland. Has he done well against Rudiger? No, Rudiger's done well, to be fair. But it is dangerous to back yourself 1v1 against Holland. Eventually, Holland will win one of those duels, and then he's in. So, it is a thing. It is a thing. Rodri, don't you... I thought, I thought, I thought Rodri was going to give away the ball again. I was about to be very upset. Thankfully, he didn't. So, it's chill. It is chill. It's not a foul. Oh my god, these guys love to stay on the floor, don't they? Come on, Jude. Get up, you little crybaby. Come on, mate. He's fine. Play on. Nothing bloody wrong with him. Right, Rodri, I don't know what I don't know what you're doing, Rodri. I I really don't know what you're doing, Rodri. Oh god. Ruben Diaz, and that's a foul by Vinicius, is it? So there we go, thank you. Rodri's got to wake up, man. Three or four times now, he's either given away a pass or got caught on the ball. Yeah, it's not a foul, but Diaz wins the ball. That's chill. Nothing wrong there for what Ruben Diaz did. Vinny did hold Rodri back, I don't know. I don't know, man. This is a contact sport at the end of the day, Nan. It's a contact sport. There's going to be some tussling. I think I think the refs had a good game so far. I, th I think it's got every decision right. No, I I I'm more than happy with it. Fair challenge by Ruben, hundred percent, hundred percent. 
Uh, we are uh, 10 minutes away from the uh, first half ending. Uh, they're showing that challenge again, but he won the ball pretty cleanly. Nothing wrong with that. No, but always VODs, no. <laughs> Once again, it's incredibly risky from Rudiger. He's winning He's winning the battle currently, but Holland only needs to win one. And then he's in. Bernardo, don't take the shot. I thought he was going to shoot. If we just, like, force a corner, that might be nice. That's not very nice, Tay. What's he done? De Bruyne is on the bench, yes. Oh, Asane bottled it. What is happening with uh, Arsenal, then? What is going on? Why are they uh, allowing all these situations? <laughs> Bellingham... Bellingham is not playing like a man who knows that he is one yellow away from missing the next leg. He's committed a foul there, off the ball, and then he's proceeded to gestate to the referee as if to say he's got the, like he's done that. And earlier he like threw his arm at the referee. He he's walking a very very tight rope at the moment. And again it. He could have got a yellow for, like, any of those actions. Like, you know, s certain referees will, like, show you a yellow for, like, dissent in, in that respect. Again, he, he needs to, uh, chill out. Well, no, he doesn't need to chill out. He needs to keep doing it. We want him, we want as many players out as possible. But you know what I mean? It is it is weird that he's doing that. Drew got sent off from a chain La League over his anger issues. Well, let's hope to have some more of those. Oh, Bernardo. Again, we got we get we're getting caught on the ball far too easily. And the Kanji fouls Vinicius, and that will be a yellow for stopping the counter. And we we are really uh we are really sloppy in the midfield. Really sloppy. I don't know what we're doing. Kanji had to had to bring him down, I think. It's definitely a yellow card. Yeah, we just need to sort ourselves out. Toby, I don't know, mate. You just got Kane, says chat, brilliant. Yeah, we need to get into half-time. Just 2-1 down. I, I still can't believe that we're losing, by the way. 2-1 down. And be like, guys, we are... Let's not forget that we are Man City, and we are supposed to be good at passing the ball. He didn't need to punt that there. Diaz had so much more time. Uh, shows the game in the bottom of the corner of the screen. Alan, that would be against the law, mate. I can't do that, I'm afraid. We haven't... That, by the way, guys, there's not been one corner in this game. I've just I've just noticed. Uh, no, Prince Smith. Even though, even though I've criticised Walker, rightly so, he's been bad this season, these are the games where you do want him because he loves the 1v1 with players like Vinicius. Uh, yeah, there we go. Cover drop deep, and this this is why this guy says why I wanted Edison. Like, look at how intense Real Madrid are being here with their pressing. Rodri, good switch to a Kanji, does well there to keep that in play, does he? Oh my God, these Real Madrid players are fucking pathetic. These Rodrigo is the third one to roll around like he's been shot. I I, I don't know what's going on with them. I don't know what's happening. Don't don't play it. Don't kick it out. Keep going. It's his own fault if he's if he wants to play act and be on the floor. Like to be honest, if you want to if you want to be a baby, don't know what Foden's doing there yet? Goal kick. He's there's nothing wrong with him. Get up, Rodrigo, you little pussy. Jesus, man. We should start a FIFA game. And play it in real life. Wait, what? Yeah, I don't know what Foden did there. Let's have a look at this. There's nothing in that, man. Like, get up, Rodrigo. He feels an arm touch his cheek and he, de and, and he decides to go down like he's been shot. Like, come on, bro. Get up. Every time I see touches around when you play, they fall down like they got shot by 50 cal. Literally. It's pretty, um... It's, it's just childish at this point. I don't, I don't know, Kieran. I don't know. Yeah, it's been the most uh, Real Madrid game so far. In my opinion, they've been... They're very fortunate to be in the lead, but ultimately they are in the lead, and that's what matters. 
I don't even know what that means, Nan. Ha, 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 ha. Was that the air for the first cycle of weeks? What a place. Yeah, I love that from you, Kieran. <laughs> Toby, what's going on? Yeah, we need more Foden on the ball. He's been very isolated. And our, and our midfield... Uh, the players who you normally associate as being control-based, Rodri and Bernardo Silva, are just not at it yet. They just keep getting caught out. Yeah, yeah, like... Do you not just have any shame at that point? Dream midfield pairing next season. Give me Pakatar. I couldn't, Alan. I could not. Like, there, like, from, like, why, why are we playing that so quickly, guys? We just need to calm it down there, Kova. Calm it down. Chill, chill. Yeah, thanks for that, Alan. And I, I just won't pay you, sadly. That's the one, Tom. This time wasting is crazy. The Julian. Ha, ha, ha. Right, come on. Let's have some action. Jack Camavinga wins it. Gavardiol into Jack, into Rodders, to Kova. Real Madrid have it back here. Kova wins it back. No, he doesn't. And now Camavinga falls over and Bellingham falls over. Lots of... It, it must be a really slippery pitch, the amount of uh, falling over that's been ha that's happened in this game so far. Under very minimal to no pressure. Again there, Bernardo. I don't know what you're playing at, man. Why are you getting caught out again? Here's Vinicius again. And straight, into straight down the throat of Ortega. But what are we doing? Bernardo, fucking wake up, mate. I don't care that you've scored a goal. You've been playing like shit. Wake up. I don't know what Bernardo's up to there. Uh, why can't phone drop D to receive more touches? He can't. Yeah, Prince Smith, I'd, li I'd like to see him do that if we need to do that. Why is Foden out on the right? What is happening? Why is Foden out on the right? What is happening? We've just seen that Bernardo Silva is not doing it in terms of controlling the ball. Why is Bernardo more central than Phil? It's not even like it's a temporary thing. He's staying there. Upset. Gerard's been on the pitch. It is strange, Riven, and it's strange because it's like, it sounds like I'm like discrediting Real Madrid, and I guess I am in a way. Um, but we've just been like gifting them chances. This isn't like the Aston Villa game where they force the issue and they force us into so many errors. Like, we're just getting caught on the ball, and we don't have to. We just don't have to. It's sad that that ball by Ortega, that's not quite there. Foden did so well, and then makes a pig's ear of it. You got it. in those situations, Erling. You've got to do better. But in that this season, John, that's exactly what he's been. I, well, Prince Smith, I don't agree because against uh, well against Liverpool, he was shoved out to the right, so we can't really expect him to do much there. Um, against Arsenal, I agree he should have been better. He should have also been found a lot more, and Arsenal were very good defensively. Um, uh, no, I'm not sure about that one, mate. <laughs> He's giving away the ball twice, leave it leading to dangerous areas. I want to see more Grealish, yeah. I wouldn't mind that. Come on, Jack. Sort them out. I don't know, Tom. Probably. Right, Rodri, you've done it again. I don't know what you're playing at, Rodri. Good work, Ikanji. Wins the throw-in. But Rodri, for a third time, has given away the ball, and he just states as if to say, like, where are my teammates? But if there's no options, Rodri, go backwards. There's always an option with City. <laughs> Liam, shut up. What's wrong with De Bruyne? He's unwell, apparently. And here is little feel. I have used it twice already, Nan. I don't know why. 
It is a good word, to be fair. If we're being fair, and I think I am, it is a good word. Kova's not having a good game either, to be honest. Kanji, can you control that a bit better, mate? That's a handball. Wow, referee says it isn't. Okay, they look like a handball to me. We take those. We take those. Right, phone's back in the middle. Good. Again, why isn't that? Like, look, it, it, Rodrigo did that. I'm sorry. That should be a yellow card. Get him off. Get him off the pitch, I reckon. As Saliba gets nervy in the Champions League. Hmm. That's lovely by Jack. Rodri in a very advanced position. Flicks it over. All and competing. And he fouls, does he? And the Ro Ro Foden wanted it. Rodri didn't give it to him. Carl and mob chart Italian goons. Slip something into its in Madrid cuisine. <laughs> Shut up, Marseille. Yeah, head on to arm. Yeah, it's definitely fouled by Hall, and he, he just gets a bit too aggressive with that. Half time in the Arsenal game. Still 2 1 to the, uh, to the Bayern. Rico on for Kova. Yeah, Kova's not been the player I thought he was going to be. Like, I, I think starting him was arguably the right decision, regardless of whether De Bruyne's available or not, because. Because cause, cause I, I, I'm of the opinion that we, we needed full control to start. But we haven't really been playing like that. And now Gavardio's horrendously out of position. And Vinicius has popped up on the right. Good work, Gavardio. Deny the corner. Well done, Ortega. It was also bad against Palace, to be fair, Alan. And also, like, we can't afford him to be having bad games in a, in the Champions League quarterfinals against Real Madrid at the Bernabeu. <laughs> We can't afford that to happen. Phone's been anonymous, to be honest, City Till I Die. Come on, Phil. Whenever he's been on the ball, I don't think he's really given it away, but I've not seen anything from him. That's the issue. Rodri into Bernardo. Will he keep that in? Can we win a corner? No? Okay. We go back. There's one minute left. Can we do something before half time? Or are we going in 2 1 down? Nothing on for a Foden there. Uh, 45 seconds left in the first half. Let's do something, boys. Even if it's just a cross, maybe force an error or force something. Might as well go for it now. Bernardo giving away the ball again. That's far too easy, man. How are they already in, in on the counter again? And there we go. Right, we've got the bodies back now. Actually, we haven't got that many bodies back. Why is it taking eight? There we go. Okay, Bernardo, good tackle there. But why did it take you so long to get there, mate? Good Lord. Oh, Ro yeah, Rodri, mate. I don't know what is going on with you, mate. But that is, I think I've now counted five errors from you. And half time. Um... A very unusual first half there, guys. Perfect start. A really, like, unfortunate, uh, deflected situation. Not, not to speak. If, if I, I speak, speak, I am in, in, big in big trouble. trouble. In big trouble. And I don't want to be in big trouble. Uh, oh, why did my thing not work? Why did, why did the text-to-speech not work? That's weird. Hmm. That should have worked. I don't know. Uh, let's see if I can sort that out now. Why wouldn't that have worked? Prefer not to speak. That should have worked. Why wouldn't it? Did I not set, say to put an input in? Oh, use input required. My bad. Right, that's my bad. I thought I'd save that. Obviously not. Use input required. Boom. It didn't save. It didn't save my settings for some reason. Okay. There we go. Uh, it should work right now. It should work now. Um, I prefer not to speak. It, it, yes, it should have one now, Nan. Apologies. There's a, there's a new one. Uh, it should have been killed. Uh, too vulnerable on the counter. I don't see who will score in open play. Uh, we need a moment to draw this match, says Matty. 100%. Uh, we definitely still can. Uh, as I say, I, I'm just very annoyed at the manner in which... Um, 
in which we've de we decided to gift them two goals. The first, again, no, well, not not gift the first one. The first one I can't even, I can't be too mad about. It's just like it's just like whatever. The second one though is like unforgivable. Like it's one all. Liam will get there. Don't you worry. It's one all. We we we're, we're chilling. It's all good. Um, and then, and then we just um. We we'll just play this really weird high line for no reason. I agree, Louis. Rodri is giving away the ball. It's bad. He's playing bad. Bernardo is also playing bad. I don't care that I don't care that he scored. He's not been good. Um, I've not seen. I've not been able to see enough of Foden. Uh, Holland is currently getting uh, marked out of the game by Rudiger, but there have been a couple times where. Rudiger's just had to make a last-ditch thing. So if we keep doing that, to be fair, like Holland's fighting that, and what that is doing, to be fair, it is taking a whole defender out of the game. Um, so if we can get more players around him, then that is that would be a, a lovely time had by all. Uh, Big Papa says, I don't trust Kovac to have this uh, role. He's going to give the ball away bad soon. Roger looks knackered. Where's Phil? Yes, good questions, all of them. Uh, I will head over to the stream chats now uh, for the Patreon phone in. I'm currently joined by Liam Byrne, who hopefully, for once, will not think that game Where's Toby? was boring. Right, was don't set me up like I haven't already told you I thought it was boring. Um, the game sucked, to be honest, mate. Have you not been excited by Real Madrid counterattacks? No, because I want you to win this time. Why? What? <laughs> because I want you to have a fixture pilot, mate. Oh. Do you not think the momentum's a thing? And that actually City should win this... It would be in City's interest to win it for momentum purposes. I think that's the case of Arsenal. But I think... You're gonna want to win the league and win every game either way, so... The chance of you... Um, the best chance of you dropping points if you get an injury and to especially some certain Spanish man and because he's playing so much. He's playing like crap today as well. Because because Pep just plays him every game, hopefully he gets an injury. That's crazy. your best chance of dropping points. Hopefully he gets an injury, that's crazy. <laughs> Mate, uh, I pray that that man gets an injury. We've been destroyed by injuries this season and you get them to the same fucking players every time. And it's never the one that it needs to be, ever. No one cares about Ake. I don't care if he gets injured. Fuck off. <laughs> no, Rodri, go away. Mm. Uh, hello, uh, Gen Z. Uh, Vinny keeps <laughs> getting caught. He's giving up on the run. Dinos has been, has been crap. Shit. I agree. He's been so shit. He, yeah, he's, he's not been great, has he? Uh, KDB, fake illness. He'll play in the uh, well, he's on the bench, so he's clearly available to, uh, to an extent. He's still an Emmy Martinez. Uh, brilliant. Um, why is phone goes against big teams? I, again, I, I don't think that that's necessarily the main issue with this game. We're not able to actually find him, and the main culprits for that, I can only point to Rodri and Bernardo, as we've discussed. If they, the whole point is that you can't get to the third phase of the game without doing the second phase well. We can't create chances if we can't progress the ball up the pitch properly. Um, and Roger and Bernardo have not been doing it. They just keep getting caught out. Like whether it's Roger with his weird passes or getting caught out. Like Bernardo has been caught out at least twice, which have led to dangerous counter attacks. Um, it's a really weird situation. And thank you so much for following uh, Gen Z as well. Uh, John Russell doesn't know how we're losing the game. At least Camavinga too many are missing the next game. Camavinga's not. He's not been booked, has he? No, Camavinga's not been booked. Um, Tumen is the only player that's been booked so far. Never use that soundboard again in my presence. <laughs> uh, where's uh, where's Finney? What's his name? He's he's only he doesn't actually want them injured. Uh, guys, don't worry. Uh, no, uh, no, I promise you, I want him injured. No, you don't. If anyone's crying about me saying, uh, "Why are you wishing injured?" I don't give a fuck. You think I care? I don't care. Wait, so Hope he you... snaps his ACL while he's at it as well. Come. I don't give a fuck. Uh, I hope he gets injured. Let's chill, let's chill. I thought you were a City um, fan smoking pipe. I'm a... Uh, what's it? Huh? No, not you. Oh. I was going to say, I thought you were trying to call me a City fan. Fuck off. Uh, Lewis on for Cova says, Roy, genuinely, that might be interesting. Um, 
that could be fun because Ikov has been as I say he's one of those players who we, we need him to have a good game in order for our forwards to have good games um and it's just not really been happening we haven't created outside like the first like five ten minutes haven't really created anything um and yeah we just need to be more bit more measured on the ball to be honest like Real Madrid aren't it's not even like they're in my opinion playing that well we're just sort of playing really weirdly and, and I don't quite understand uh the replay suggested that Kovacic could maybe go to close Camavinga I think that's a bit harsh personally but it's, it's a massive deflection I don't know man I think it's just a massive deflection there's not really much you can do about that where's Toby at I don't know mate he should be in it needs to show his face uh, don't worry, Asher. He's, he's only joking, mate. Despite all this, we're losing because of deflections. Good point, John. Uh, Rikolos, we get cooked in this fixture. I don't know. I don't know. I've, I he'd, be more, he'd probably be more secure in the ball at this point. Asher, mate, I promise you I'm not joking. I promise you on Stewie everything. Points. I'm being serious. I promise you. Stewie says, it's weird how there's no corner in the first half. Possibility of more than 10 corners in the second half. Uh, probably not. But yeah, you're right. Yeah. I think I put touch on this. There has been no corner in the whole first half, which is really weird. Um, yeah, odd. Uh, their setup is weird. They're squeezing the pitch as soon as we play into phone cover and using ah. the fifth centre half off the ball. It's a cold, interesting <laughs> analysis there. Um, ah. What are you laughing I said at? You just got caned. You just got caned. Oh, oh it's to it Toby. <laughs> Wait, you dragged him in? Oh, you okay? Oh, yeah, because you made no, him in. No, I dragged him in. It wasn't even me. Okay, there we, we got DR as well. Uh, right, Liam, you, you wanted to say something to Toby. <laughs> Literally, all I wanted to say was he got caned. To be <laughs> right, Toby, you're an I'm Arsenal just... fan. What you thought? I haven't, I haven't watched the game. What's, what's, what's going on? Why are you losing, you little rat? He got caned. I don't know, mate. I just. <sighs> Do you ever feel like there's just no hope anymore? And. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. I just. <laughs> I don't know, man. I just, I just, uh, I don't know where to go from here. To be honest with you, lad, I think maybe I should have tailed my expectations of facing Bayern in the Champions League, considering we got slapped by him for content to last, last leg we had against them. Is there hope? Um, Are you still going to get something from this game? You know, there's hope because fucking. I mean, both of Bayern's goals have been on the counter. They've been very efficient with them. Two, two shots on target. Two shots in the whole game. Two goals. One of them being a penalty, obviously. Was it a penalty? Yes. Do I feel that it's a bit soft? Yes. Do I only feel that way because I'm an Arsenal fan? Yes. Brilliant. Um, I just, I just, I, it, it's a weird one, man. It's just, they've been very good on the counter. I think Arsenal can definitely get something from the game, but it's just like, as much as Tuchel has been an absolute hooner for Bayern Munich, knockout tournaments are his bread and butter. That's kind of what, what he's good at, I suppose. Especially when you consider he got Chelsea to a Champions League, whilst they were probably the worst team in all of out of all the semi finalists of that season as well. Mm. I don't know, man. And also the quality of Bayern's squad as well. Our squad is quality, but then you look at like Kane, Musiala. But then it's weird because they have Eric Dyer as well, so it's, like, it's a confusing one. But yeah, it's just that we don't deserve to be winning. And I'd actually, I'd actually go as far to say Bayern probably do deserve to be ahead as well because as much as they've been playing on the counter, their two goals were. Hmm. Um, deserved, which hurts. There we go. Uh, DR, what the final score is going to be, mate? What? What are the final scores going to be? Can you hear me this time? Yes. Yes, we can fucking hear you talk. I'm going to... Right, actually, I'm going to kill... I'm, I'm, not, I'm, I'm going to kill you. I'm never asking you another question. I'm never asking you another question ever again. You are such a rat. Um, uh, Stewie says Arsenal are beating... Uh, Someone sorry. banned me off speaking. Right. What's the final score going to be, DR? What's the final score going to be? 4 one Real Madrid. Right. What's the final score going to be in the Arsenal game? 4-1. He's been banned from speaking. Banned from speaking? What does that mean? He's like when he's been muted. Right, it was stop, like this last him. stream as what, well. What's the final? That was what, what's the final score going to be in the Arsenal four one, game? Four one, four one, Bayern. Oh Jesus! Right, okay, that's a lot of goals then. Goodness me! I can four, see why you're yeah. not allowed to talk. Fucking hell! Four one is crazy. Uh, okay, he's definitely not scoring. Him. 
uh, Loago says we should stop playing a high line. I, I well, certainly were like, when they just like have the ball in their own box, like, what's the point of- The hell was that? <laughs> now. Stop. Right, stop definitely right. It's not even me. Right. I'm going to go to the second half now, guys. Final score predictions, please. Um, 3-2 Arsenal because I'm delusional and 3-2 Madrid. Liam. Um, 3-1 three, three Bayern and... 2-2 two, two. nice we'll take those thank you guys so much uh, for joining me yeah guys I don't, I, I don't know who's doing that to DR Let, let's not do that guys he's an oblet so let's, uh, let's allow DR to speak next time please thank you very, thank you kindly uh, Horn's the most non-pet player ever uh, well he signed him so it's not entirely true um, <laughs> can attack going to kill to play the high I agree uh, both could be worth looking into what's that the stuff Oh, sorry, Bob on for Silver, Lewis on for Cova. Um, uh, people didn't, people lost interest. Yeah. Maybe we'll do them again in the future. Uh, it, it just takes age. They take, they take hours to do, and like like eight people were turning up, so it wasn't worth my time. That sounds really harsh, but it wasn't worth my time to do. Um, I've been disappointed with that first half. Obviously, the main reason why I'm disappointed is because we literally they. By virtue of them being bad defensively, they gifted us a goal. And then and then with that uh, chance... Foden, when he isn't playing against good defenders. Uh, and with that chance, we, again, first goal is whatever. Second one, I, I just can't understand. And then from there, we've just been... We just keep we just keep doing it. We just keep giving the ball away. We just keep getting caught in possession. We just keep misplacing passes from deep and we're not actually able to get the ball into our attackers so people saying you know Foden Hall and should be doing more I agree to an extent killed. but I think if he's got, got to look into it, it I think irrespective of him having a yellow, yellow card, card he should be banned for a long time because that was the most dangerous thing I've seen in a football field for many many years Brian smiley face emojis I had emojis won't work I don't think um yeah there we go uh lack of walker showing would hold the width and allow fun into the middle without phone stuck out wide oh yeah well this this was like the one game where i would have wanted um i would have wanted walker to start purely from the pace of walker uh, uh sorry the pace of vinicius phone hides on the if phone's being asked to play being asked to play on the wing lorenzo then he's being asked to play on the wing I don't have the best lips, thank you, mate. Uh, they've been having Rodrigo and Vinny on Akanji and Carvajal on Gavardi. Oh, wait, what? Yeah. Oh, I, I, oh, I see what you mean. Yes, and look, we all knew how they were going to play. We all knew it was going to be like this. But again, we've, we've not really decided to do anything. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Which death upon me? Kane after going trophyless for the fifteenth time, but dunking on Arsenal again. Hey guys, if if we're going to be, I'm not saying that anyone. I don't think anyone's had a good game for City realistically. Um, but if if you if we want to be picking out names, a phone and hall and should not be the first names on your lips. It sh it should be Rodri, Kovacic, and Bernardo, in my opinion. Um, there's not much our attackers can do if our if our midfield isn't like that in the, the first and second phase. Just give away the ball. Uh, duality if wanted to watch the stream but not wanted to spoil the game. I thought you were watching the Arsenal game though, Toby. Uh, yeah, uh, Tom, I know. Yeah, yeah. Ramage are not good enough. They can be beaten. They can be beaten, but for some reason we, we gifted them uh, we gifted them a goal. Uh, I think Grealish has been good. I, I, I'll go along with that. But again, haven't been able to haven't seen enough of him. And I think a lot of that stems from, as I, I'll say it again, uh usual cautious not not cautious controlled midfielders just making very unusual decisions or 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 actions or inactions rather there we go uh second half has commenced well oh well i'll only 
I'll only know that if you're watching it live, Toby, I won't because I only know from a. Uh, I, I only know from like the feed, and that normally takes like you know a few minutes to go through. I only knew the I knew, I only knew Arsenal had a penalty because someone told me in the chat. There's a second half of football to be played, guys. I find William Mifi was having a hard time. Indeed, DR, indeed. And again, I don't think it's because I don't think it's because Real Madrid have done anything particularly good. Like Rodri's just making weird er errors. I thought phone's part of a midfield three. If you think phone's part of a midfield three, if you think City play a midfield three, Prince Smith, um, I, I, I would. We we don't we, we don't we haven't played a midfield three in years. We don't play a midfield three. It's a foul on little feel. What is Mendy's fucking problem? Let him take the free kick, you bitch. Come on, City, says Alexander. Indeed. Me on my way to the Samaritan's helpline after we get 7 to 2 over two legs. I take a code for Doc and Sit Bernardo. More central. Okay, we, that, that might happen. I mean, it might need to happen at some point. If you're watching on the YouTube, leave a like on the video. Listen to Baby Nobbins. Yeah, and Rudiger's done a very good, a very good job on Holland so far. But again, it's it's incredibly tight margins. He needs to drop deep, but he likes to drop deep. But clearly, he's not being told to do that. It's definitely a foul by Kamavinga. Who's your favorite player right now? Mine's Jack. That's a good. That's a good answer, Austin. I do like Jack a lot. Millwall are beating Leicester. Big up to the Millwall. Please what? Oh, sorry, you want points. Well, don't just give him them, though. That You know, this is a uh, inflation and all that. And all that. Right, come on, City. Holland brings Grealish into play. He controls it. Got no options, though. Coming against fouled. What a shame. There were just no options for Jack there. Had to go back and we end up losing the ball. Why am I being shown this replay? I want to see the action. Guys. There we go. I said you have the ball somehow. Nice. Jack guy. Hey, I, I love Grealish, man. You guys know this. Kovacic into Bernardo. This is looking dangerous. Here's Jack. City, you've got bodies in the box. Takes a shot and it's well over, though. I, I admire the fact he went for the shot, though. I have said he needs to do that more. No worries, Austin. That's good from Jack. I like that. I like the aggression. Not bad at all. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah, good move. Yeah, that, 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 was, that, was, that was good, to be fair. That, that was decent. That was decent. Declan Rice is so quick. He is, he's got long legs. He's got long legs, so he can be a quick boy. He can cover ground very quickly. Holland can't control the ball. Gabriel would help us more in this game than Holland. Okay, Prince Smith. If you think that, I actually don't know what to say to you. We're going to have to agree to disagree, and I, I don't want to pursue that line of inquiry because it's boring. Uh, love that from Jackie Boy. Seven letters yet. Yeah, totally. Gavanti on nice touch. What a ball that is by Yoshko into a uh, feel. Clips it to Holland. It's not a good cross. Comes to Jack in the box, though. Ah, Jack in the box. You get it. Oh, I thought we were going to take a shot there, Jack. That was so good from Gavardio, though. That ball, like, cut through Real Madrid's whole defense. That's a foul. When are you going to start booking these players, referee, by the way? Like, that's the second foul Vinicius has made. Come on now. Again, he needs to chill out. Started well, yeah, I agree. I agree. It's been a decent start. Just need to put more pressure on them. Like someone mentioned it at half time. There's not been a single corner. Now let's do that. Put them under some set piece pressure. Why not?
And it's a free kick to City. Mm. Many men wish death upon me. Store option John off. Henry after organising terrorist attacks on City and Arsenal but Rodri and Saliba die so Liverpool win the league. Fuck. Oh, what a waste of a free kick by the way, just nothing. Another free kick. A lot of stop starting in this game. Many men wish death upon me. Bernardo, oh my god, Bernardo, can you stop playing like total dog? Well done, Kovacic, you won it back. Christ, Bernard. Oh, come on, Bernardo, you've given it away again, man. What are you doing? Offload that ball. I don't know what I'm watching with this, with this Bernardo, with Bernardo today. I don't know what he's doing. He gave it away initially. Kovic just won it back. And then he gave it away for a second time in a row. I agree with him. I don't know what he's doing. He's not, he's not, he's not having a good one. He's not, he's not having a good time. Ha uh ha. -huh. Da da da. Da da da. Like, hey, like, oh, get, get rid of it there. Get rid of it there. Just overruns it, and then Rudiger tackles him. He's not having a good time. To be honest, any visible changes in the second half for City? Uh, well, it looks like we're just committing to Foden on the right. For some reason. Outside of that, no real changes that I can see. Came to been booked. Does that mean anything, Tom? Oh yeah, what's the situation in the Bayern Arsenal game in terms of their yellows? Like, are any of them at risk of missing the second leg? As as there are in this game. Like Diaz for Oh my god, Diaz just gave away the ball then. Rodri is forced to foul Bellingham, but no, it's a, an advantage. So we can't even foul properly now, guys. We can't even foul properly. Akanji did brilliantly well there. He's denied that pass into Bellingham from Vinicius. <laughs> I don't know what wait what what Bellingham's in our box somehow takes a shot and it's well wide what 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 is going on what happened there Foden decided to clart the ball into Roger I, I can't really blame Rodri for not being able to control that Yeah, we're making very weird decisions here. Go past the Rodri, bounce off him, yeah. That's such a foul. When are you going to start booking Rudiger, though, mate? Because he, he's he, Holland has been doing that all game, and Rudiger's been doing that all game, and that's the first time you've called that as a foul. Holland winning that exchange, and that's what I mean, guys. Eventually, it will come to the, it, it could come to the point whereby. Not only does it just get up the pitch massively, but if Rudiger gets booked, he can't do that anymore. And then you're in. Potentially. Kane's always been dirty. Yeah, no, yeah, that, that stupid little move he does, which could genuinely injure people, is like, re is really scummy. To be fair, it is really scummy. Uh, right. Another free kick for City. Can we do something with this? Potentially. Grealish ball in, Rodri to attack, and it's well over. What a shame. Oh, KDB was throwing up. That's why I was on the bench. Apparently he was ill. Don't know what the illness was exactly. Yeah, again, Rodri, do I expect a bit more from you there? Maybe. He's English, so it's fine. Wait, Tom, what? Uh, Andre Onana's full name is Andre Onana Onana. That is a fun fact. Toby, sadly, it will happen eventually. Like, surely it's only a matter of time. Yeah, there's been so many free kicks in this game as well. It's just been, like, very bitty. Which isn't really preferable for Sissy. 
Kane's middle name is Edward. I did not know that either. Harry Edward Kane. Right, come on, boys. What have you got for me in the second half, if anything? Let's punt it up. Can you win that, John? You can. Well done. Oh, Rodri, stop giving away the ball, please. Please, mate. You're really upsetting me. Oh, Vinicius is in. That's going to be a goal, is it? Oh, my God. It's just over. Christ. It's not even a save, though. Again, just blazes it over. Jesus, man. I don't know what we're doing giving away the ball so frequently. It just absolutely lashes it. Curti just won a duel, to be fair. Pep wanted Maguire over Diaz. What? That's true, but Ruben Diaz is a lot better. So it's a good thing we didn't get him. If De Bruyne's available, take off Bernardo for him. I don't know. I don't know his, il his illness situation. Yeah, that's like a pet peeve of mine as well, uh, Liam. Riven says, I think this ends 3-1. We aren't getting into this the way we need to. We're not, are we? If we can keep it to a one-goal deficit, that's not the end of the world. I I, I probably would still back us to... Um, I probably would still back us to win it. Hello, my name. Hope you're enjoying yourself, matey. That's good by Rodri. That's a foul. That should be a yellow card, really, on Kamavinga. Won't give it. But that was bad on Kamavinga and Rodri. I did, Tom. Right, come on, City. Can we do something with this attack? Ramadre got boys back now. And yeah, we, we, we're, too, we're very, very slow in those moments. Very, very slow. Now they've got all the bodies back. So we did win the ball back. They didn't have as many bodies back. And there we go. Yeah, slowing down the attack. I don't really know why we're doing this. Fizz into stones there. Oh. Yeah, we need yeah, we just need to speed things up. I think maybe it genuinely someone suggested bring on Rico Lewis. That actually might be a shout, you know. It's a good run by Foden. Give space to Bernardo. Can he do anything with it? Okay, we'll go back to Diaz. Interesting. I would, I'd be 100% happy with a draw. And I said that before. Uh, well, that's a foul. Fucking hell, referee. <laughs> I have no idea how a foul's not been given in that exchange on Foden. That was craziness. Foden might get booked for crying at the referee. And that's a terrible pass, man. Rodri, what are we up to here? Rodri. That's such a foul. Uh, and that's, uh, so it wasn't even the Camavinga or it was the Cruz one. I don't know what Rodri's up to. He's playing like doo-doo. That should be a yellow card in Camavinga. Wasn't given. I don't know. I don't, I don't know what's happening with Rodgers, guys. This is two he's had two properly bad games all season. Uh sadly, they've been back to back. Palace and now this one. Yoshko into Bernard. Here's little Phil. Takes a shot straight down the throat of the goalkeeper, though. I guess that's better, though. We might as well go for those sorts of shots. Because we know we're capable of scoring them. Martin tries that one in 100,000 shot at Fletcher City every time I watch him. That's better from Phil, though. I, I like that, John. Don't know about you. That's nice from Cover. Look at Holland. Look at him. Oh, Bernard. Oh, he takes a shot. Rudiger clears it. He, he went for it, to be fair to him. Again, I, I just feel like we're not really... Oh, Gavardiol. That's a foul on Jack. Ref, ref, plays, ref plays on. That was good by Cover. Cover's been better the second half. Bernardo Rodri still giving it away, though. We've got Bernardo's chat. Is better now, yeah, I, I agree. Still not ideal. Still not optimal. But it's an improvement. We still haven't really forced their keeper into any true saves yet, though. Like, a lot of it's been very standard in terms of, like, punches or catches. 
haven't really forced the error. I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind seeing a few more long shots. Or, you know, shots from distance. <laughs> Liam, driving with it. Foden into John. Play it quicker. Oh my God! You, even, Stones are get nearly got. What's it as well? A Gavardiol. What is going on here? That's really good tracking back by Foden. Stops Vinicius in his tracks. A Kanji then just decides to go around the outside. He wins the ball. Diaz can't dive in. He doesn't. Good work, Ruben. But again, a, sl a sloppy pass under no pressure is the reason why... Uh, is the reason why uh, your amateur had a potential counter there. Just don't quite understand. Here is Rodrigo. This is dangerous now. Valverde takes the shot and it's well over. Uh, Linus has one big up. So it's got to be worried about our season if these rush performances become more common. Hopefully it's a, a one or two off. Yeah, if we are going to take those shots, we need, we need to be hit them with a bit more venom. To be honest with you guys. Burr -da -burr. Burr -da. Haven't had, we had lots of opening goals in both games. It's still 2-1 in both games. Yeah, Ro well, tell you what, Rodri's not defending his unbeaten streak very well. I will say that. I, I will say that he's, he's not really contributing to his own record here. With these errant balls. It has been a very weird game. It has been a weird game. There's still, look, there's still time. There's always time. There's always time for anything. Uh, this game's giving me anxiety, says Lazy Unicorn. Ball comes to Phil. Bernardo. Can we fight? Can we actually get the first corner of the game? No, we can't. I thought we were going to try to play for one there. Just to just to have something, but no. Kanji's got to be careful with Bellingham here. Bellingham gives the ball away. I haven't seen any, any of Bellingham this game, to be fair. Which I guess is good. It's been much more Rodrigo and Vinicius, I'd suggest. Grealish in the box. Quit inside and shoot, mate. You know you want to. That's a corner. There we go. A corner. We retain possession, boys. I'd be more than happy with a draw, guys. More than happy with a draw. Things happen when we're winning in corners. Yeah, we're 1-0 up on corners. Crazy. Yeah, well, things do happen when Jack's on the ball. Which is nice, obviously. Covert into Phil. He tried to create some space for himself. He's fouled there. What? Holland, unbelievable tracking back. Holland, well done. That, I've no idea how that wasn't a foul. Um, I need to see that back. That looked like the most blatant foul to me. Somehow it's not a free kick. City get the ball back anyway. I'm convinced Foden was fouled there by Vinicius, but it's whatever, I suppose. Grealish is the best player today. I agree. Is it, I don't think he's made one mistake. Yeah, guys, we were talking about, you know, the left-back situation. Uh, Holland's left-footed. Maybe he should be the left-back. Strong, aerially dominant, quick. Not going to out-muscle him. Stones into Bernardo. Uh. Kanji, back. Again, just no... No, like... Uh, oh, that's really nice by Kovacic. Kamavinga does well to win it back, to be fair. I thought, I thought Kovacic made the right decision there. Kamavinga's longer legs just got oh, let him to get away with it. City win it back, though. Good work, Rodri. Now turn. Look, three of their players actually aren't behind, aren't behind the ball for once. Go. Go, Phil. Take the... No, oh, why didn't you play in Hall when he was there, man? Phil! Oh, he should have played in Erling. Oh, that's not the right decision, Phil. I can't defend you there, mate. Or take you. better be out there. And he is good. Good, good, good. Oh... That's such a shame. That that was it. The turn from Phil was brilliant. I don't know why he went for goal. I don't know why he went for goal. He's normally so unselfish in those... In fact, he's normally overly unselfish. He should have tried to slip in Erling there, man. He was desperate for it. That was the one. That could have been it. <sighs> Come on, boys. 
Can we create another chance? 25 minutes in. Lads, if... Let, let's... You don't like to touch walls? So I love it. So, yeah, come, come. What? God, my, why is my PC popping off? Goodness me. Um, Let's assume for argument's sake, City lose this game 1-0. Do you still back City to go through? Or do you think that Real Madrid would take the tie at that point? Let me know what you think. Boom with another shot. Oh! Come on! Phil! Yes! Come on! <laughs> yes! Oh my god, I love you so much! Oh my god, Phil! Yes! Yes! Where the lights are brightest! Where the lights are brightest! The Stockport fucking Iniesta turns up! What a fucking thunder cunt of a goal that is! Yeah, pick that one out! Pick that one out, fake Madrid! Oh my god! Oh my god! What a fucking beauty of a banger that is! Oh my god! Christ, that is unbelievable. Unbelievable. When the lights shine brightest, my Ballon d'Or winner steps up, yeah? My local hero. Mine. Yeah? What a fucking goal. Shades of De Bruyne at the Bernabeu last season. Christ, what a goal. That's the best of all. Of them. Look at Pep. Look at Pep. You see? No De Bruyne, no problem. Five goals in seven matches. Jude Bellingham, eat your heart out. In before he scores two. That is unreal. What a fucking goal that was. Christ. We don't need one more. As far as I'm concerned, we don't need one more. Let's just... End. I'd be happy if we ended the game now. I'd be very happy if we ended the game now. Just let's just chill. Let's just fucking chill out. What I don't want us to do now, because we've been so much better the second half. Still some annoying errors. Still some annoying errors. Yeah, exactly. I agree. For the next, like, five to ten minutes, I just want us to chill. I'm not saying that we you know, played around our box, but I am saying we just need to calm down a bit. We don't need more. I, I, don't, I don't agree, Brad. Oh, my. Is that going to roll out, please? No, it's not rolled out. Oh, God. This is what I mean. I don't want us to be attacking. I want us to be conservative from this point. It's another deflection. Ortega uh, holds on to it. One more. Yeah, yeah. I'd, ra I'd rather we focus on getting players sent. Again, I'm very... Guys, I'm very, very confident that if we take a draw back to the Etihad, we win the tie. A, a loss is another matter. But in general, we don't lose at the Etihad. It it's been a very long time. Brentford. Oh, John. Even John is giving away silly balls. Bottom cover. Oh... That was a bullet cut, 100%. Craziness, craziness. I'm amazed at how many goals have, there have been. No, I'm, not, I'm not saying, guys, I'm not saying sit back. I'm just saying camp like on the edge of their box. That's basically what I'm saying. Have the ball. I'm not saying forfeit possession. But again, why is one ball over the top meaning that... Oh, well done, Gavardio. Brilliant work. Because Caval Cavalio tried to get in there. Good work, Ruben, as well. Lovely, lovely. Poop's been shown tonight. Fun's been underwhelmed until then. Yeah, we don't talk about that. Hey, we're using the Jude Bellingham rule. Yeah, you can you can stink up a game for ninety minutes, but if you score, you're man of the match. That's 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 the thing I'm dealing with with little Phil. Yeah, that's what I'm that's what I'm working. That's the that's what I'm operating under. Uh, that's what we get. World class, quiet game. Then boom. And we were saying to Phil, we were saying, you know, we don't mind Phil taking those shots. It might have to happen because when because they're so deep. That they aren't really giving it. It's like, you know, you, you know, the Manchester derby. It was like, we're, they're actually so deep. We're actually just going to... It's almost like they're they're inviting us to take these long shots. And we've got players like Phil Foden and Rodri and De Bruyne on the bench who love taking long shots. And they're such a threat from distance. He is him. Doubt Phil Foden at your own peril, ladies and gentlemen. Doubt him at your own peril. Indeed, Yoshko, <laughs> Yoshko Guardiola. But we do still need to calm down a bit. Again, Stones, Bernardo, Rodri. Coach, it's been a lot better this second half, to be fair. But I'm, I'm still a bit concerned at the performances at the performances of those three. Is Rodri's worst performance this season? Want to see how many possessions he's lost this game. And I, I, I agree. He's not been great at all. He does keep giving it away. Between this match and the other match, it's crazy, isn't it? I thought I, I was so convinced it's the first leg. It's going to be low scoring, you know, like nil nil, one all, maybe two one at a push. Two all, craziness. Might be three two to either side. Might be more. Is Jack in the Real Madrid box? Vardiol is going to take a shot, is he? Oh my god! Oh 
my god! What an unbelievable goal! His first one for Man City with the weak foot! Yoshko, that is my go! That is my go hybrid centre back! Oh my Christ! What a fucking goal, man! That's crazy! That's crazy! How has he scored that? This is his first goal for the club with a fucking rocket! With his weak foot! Oh, is that Jack Grealish assist? Oh my god, it's a Jack Grealish assist. I'm so happy. What a fucking goal! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> That's mental! Oh my god, once again. That is, that is what you get for camping. That is what you get for camping and playing bitch football and inviting long shots, yeah? That's what you get. Hold that. What a fucking goal. That is mental. That's mad. 3-2. At the Bernabeu. Craziness. Jack Grealish getting his assist as well. Oh, the Jack, guys. This Jack Grealish video is going to cook. Why well, Jack Grealish is better than you think, I reckon. That's what we'll do. <laughs> Massive. We've had three shots that haven't been directly at Lunin and they've gone in. Massive. Oh, that's crazy, man. Absolutely mental. They have to play bitch football. Yeah, you're not wrong, Jay. Now, we just need to chill again don't try to worry about going for another goal just bring him down here i reckon because he's being allowed to drive far too much and this here's a kanji good work a kanji we'll take that corner we take that corner good work i think he's been very good today has manu apart from that second goal but probably high line in general how yoshiko celebrate that popping off let's not have more faith because oh my days indeed that's the thing with City, guys. City can play badly, but a bad City is still a dangerous City. Yeah, if that makes any sense. Let's not concede the stupid goal from a corner, because I don't want this to be shades of the Etihad game where we won, like, 4-3. Come on, Ortega. Good work. Is that going to be another corner? Yes, it is. Okay. Another corner. Guys, Real Madrid are winning on corners. No. <laughs> I think we've been shit. I think the game's been shit. So Jack, yeah, but Jack, we're winning. So we take those. Yeah, we take those. We've got to take those. It's as simple as that. Madness. Madness. Tro oh, two all. Trossard. Wow. Mad. Again. I'm staggered at how many goals are being scored today. Two all. Crazy. Throw into Real Madrid. Is it? Yeah. Go ahead and punted it. <laughs> Tom. <laughs> what the fuck, Tom? <laughs> That's a good one, to be fair. Nine goals in two games is mad, yeah. And again, for first leg Champions League quarterfinals. Yeah, uh, well, if you look at the fixtures, I thought P PSG Barca, I looked at that and went, right, uh, that will be, a, that will be a, 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 a game with lots of goals. Um, who's the other one? It's Dorman Atletico, maybe. Let's have a look at this Trossard goal. That's a nice, really nice finish by Trossard. Oh, wait, Jack Grealish is once again it, driving into the Real Madrid box. This guy, man, I'm telling you, man, he is the difference maker. That corner. Well done, Jack. Good work. We just look so much better with him in the team, man. So much better. Don't let's go to be one on aggro over two legs. Don't let's go winning on pens. I can't believe how good that goal is, man. Once again, it's a Champions League quarter final at the Bernabeu, and people, or well, some idiots, are still questioning whether you're like good enough or whatever. And it's like, ugh, he's so good, man. He's so fucking good. He's class. His name is Jack, and he's the goat. Yeah. Can you describe Yoshko's goal? I'm driving. Basically, Yoshko, um, Jack Grealish picked with the ball on the left-hand side. He, he he played into an area for Yoshko to uh, take a really good touch. Um, and, they, and then from outside the box, he just fucking lashed it. Lashed at it with his weak right foot. Madness. 
Oh no, why have we given away the ball there? Bring him down. I'll phone try to, but he couldn't do it. What a tackle of Gavardiol. That is on that is that is unbelievable as a tackle by Gavardiol. Oh my god. Who were the idiots calling this man a flop, by the way? Oh my word. He is so good. Oh my god. And he's a centre back. Who can play left wing and left back? My 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 praise cannot be stronger. No, don't pick up Raheem. I agree. Nan, our left side has been fantastic. It's been fantastic. Yoshko has been brilliant today. They've been... Re and with that goal, Gavardio might get man of the match. Genuinely. Because he's been... So I can't think of any like real defensive errors he's made. I feel like they haven't had much joy down our left. More so down our right. It's been a good time so far. Yes, yeah, it's, it's too old to the Arsenal Riven. I know, yeah. It's a... Uh, it's a very interesting affair, for sure. Would Arsenal, I wonder, would Arsenal be happy with a point, a point, a draw? Probably not. Is that a throw in? It is. Oh, it's to Real Madrid though, what an hell. Yeah, no worries at all, Yoshka. If you're driving though, mate, you know, make sure you're safe. Get off your phone, yeah? Safety first, safety first, guys. It's a proper, uh, Toby, 100%, mate. Too old to you now, bro. Arsenal probably need the win, says Jack. <laughs> Prince <Bip -Sheet. laughs> yeah, in it. Where's Bellingham? So far, so far he's been anon anonymous. But again, again, he he he's, he's, he has games like this, and he'll he, and then he, and then he scores on like, the ninety fifth minute, and it's an incredibly annoying situation. So, don't count your chickens, guys. Do not count them. Don't count those chicks. Brahim Diaz. Raheem Diaz. Right. Uh, force them out wide, boys. Yes. And now the good thing is we've got we've got the lead somehow. So that ball's too easy though. Oh my god, you little di you little diving prick, Bellingham. You've had more dives in this game than offensive contributions. You have been shit. Get off the you do not deserve to share the same pitch as my baby boy Phil Foden. Get out of here. God, this 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 guy loves falling over, man. Give him a flopping foul. Come on. Basketball that shit. Pathetic. The amount of dives that Bellingham's made accumulated, he probably should get booked, but it's whatever. And that's the thing, guys. There will there will be no Chuman E. Yeah, exactly. He'll score a 90th minute tap in, and then, yeah. And that'll happen. That'll be a, a most upsetting occasion. Kind of thing of beats Bernardo there. Oh, you got to bring him down there, Bernardo. Modric is on the pitch, by the way. I don't know if I mentioned that. Uh, here's to Vinicius. He crosses it. Back post. That's a goal. Fantastic goal. What is going on with this game, man? Why are there so many fucking goals? I don't know why Bernardo didn't just bring down fucking Modric there on the drive. That's really disappointing. Oh, guys. How? Why are there so many goals in this game? It's a brilliant finish, to be fair. Like, I can't really complain about the finish. This is ridiculous. Uh, we we're, we're don't have a one goal lead anymore. It's now three all. And once again, this is a crazy game, man. No idea why there are so many fucking goals. And yet, there are. Yeah, uh, yeah and the goals have been of a ridiculous quality as well. Like Foden's rocket, Gavardio's rocket, Valverde then. Even like Bernardo's free kick was class. This match has been crazy. Go on, Jack. Chill out. Let's not give away the ball there, matey. Let's not give away the ball there. Uh, out muscled there. Yeah, and I will say that the Real Madrid's, like you know, from like a physical standpoint, are much uh, better than us. It must be said. They are a lot stronger. Uh, chill out, says Nan. Indeed. Yeah, just chill. Just chill. How did Bellingham nearly actually somehow get in there as well? Like, what is happening here? This is mental. Let's chill out. Again, just one ball over, and somehow Bellingham nearly get gets in uh, gets in a chance. 
Oh, yeah, like, yeah, big up, Yoshko. Start moaning. I don't even know if I'm moaning, am I? Hello? Why is Jack not playing Euro Southgate? What does that mean? Modric ball in. Yeah, let's, there's 10 minutes left, boys. Let's, karma, karma. There's Foden's, it, uh, Foden only had Gavardio to try and hit on the counter there. Should it be a foul? Gavardio somehow keeps it in play for City. That should be a yellow card. When he, uh, uh, is he actually going to book Grealish? He uh, should be booking Camavinga, man. I can't believe that it's not Camavinga who's been booked there. That is insane. <laughs> it's a yellow card by Camavinga, by the way. He, sh he should be out of the he should be out of the next leg as well. Um, but oh well. Oh well. Full confidence play over the line, says Riven. Again, guys, I'll take a draw. I'd, I'd be more than happy with a, with a draw. Let's hope we can hold on for the next 10 minutes plus. I can't imagine there being that much added time. Can't how booked, but I've no idea how Kamavinga wasn't the one that was booked. No idea. He's been, yeah, ridiculously fortunate. This has been a good game, though, especially if you're in neutral. Six goals, all of very high quality as well. Rodri into Phil. <laughs> He's giving that as a foul. That's crazy, you know. That is crazy. Oh, well. Stole my pole, says relax, haul, and fix this in the 89th minute. Hmm. We shall see what we see. Yeah, I don't know how Camavinga's got away with a book him. I don't really understand that. Jason, thank you so much for supporting Jason. Love that from you, new member. Welcome to the Ultras Club. You are a beautiful human being. Uh, thank you so much for the support. Genuinely means the world. Enjoy your emotes. Enjoy your loyalty badge. Enjoy your golden name whenever you chat. And also just enjoy the fact that you are supporting your boy. Continue to make content for you guys. Love that from you, Jason. You beautiful little man. Oh my God, Bellingham complains. Bellingham's XC, his expected, sorry, his XB, his exp expected bitch, bitchness is through the roof this game. I don't see Ramage winning at the Etihad either. That's why it's crucial that we avoid defeat here. Leicester losing. Leicester? What's wrong with Leicester, man? Aren't they supposed to be good at the football? Ha ha ha. Right. Can we please? There we go. Well done, Yoshko. Well done, Yoshko. What a performance from him, man. What a performance. Crazy. Would you reckon there's more Odegaard's hair flicks or Bellingham moans per game? Bellingham's moaning and diving per game has been staggering, to be fair. Missed the game due to work, says Jason. How do we concede? Three goals. So the first one, Jason, was a ridiculous deflected effort, which I can't even really, um... I can't even really, like, complain about. The second one, we played a ridiculous high line for no reason, and Rodrigo was, like, in. And even that was a deflection, to be fair. Um, and then their third goal was a fantastic finish by Valverde on the volley from like a like a, a relatively innocuous cross um so I can't the, the only goal I've got a genuine complaint about is the second one the first one's deflected you can say should players get closer to him I think that's very harsh um the third I, I'd have to look look back at it again it is just a wonder goal the second one's the one for me the second one's the most annoying but so City have scored three goals from an XG of 0 0.83. Real Madrid have scored three goals from an XG of 0 0.59. So six goals have been scored from an XG of 1.6, is that? That's mad. City going to get that? Yes, you are. Good. And this is mad. Oh, God. Foden's limping. Oh, fuck off, Phil. Please be okay. Really, just win the corner. That's a throw-in. Goal kick, sorry. 
Oh god, Phil, no. Oh no, please be okay, Phil. No, 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 no. No. I'm hoping it's just an impact. Oh, I think he tears down his Achilles or something. You know, like when you stamp down the side down the back of it. Oh, that's a painful one. Shut up, Liam. Yeah, it's I think it's just like the studs down the uh down the Achilles. I think it'll be fine. Vinicius is off, so he will be featuring in the second leg. Yeah, no idea how Kamavinga's not been booked. No idea how this man's not been booked. Mental, mental man. That's probably a yellow card in, in itself. It is pretty staggering how he's avoided a booking so far. I think I think for Phil, it's just... Oh, no, Alvarez is coming on. Oh, that tells... Well, hopefully, it's just precautionary. Yeah, no idea how Kamavinga's not been booked. Hopefully for Foden, it's just an impact. If it's anything more than that, then we are fucked. Let's have another look at this. This is the Gavardio goal. Ridiculous, man. Ridiculous goal. He's so far out as well. The touch and then the weak foot. Oh, God, he's so talented. A person never get many books at home. Expect someone to get away with it. It's just like... You like to think the games should be officiated like correctly though, don't you? Alas, alas. Yeah, hopefully phone's all right. He's sort of limping. But hopefully he'll be fine. If if Foden's out for any amount of time then then we're absolutely shafted. Because we need we need our best player this season. We'll have to see. As I say, hopefully it's just impact. But if if Kamavinga if if Kamavinga gets gets out of this game without a booking, and if he's actually injured Foden, I'm going to have an agenda against him for the rest of my career as a human. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna state that right now. Arsenal, it's still two all. Yes, it's still two all. It's annoying because I thought the referee the referees played well for most of the game, but. Some moments, like he, he's he's been a bit of a coward in terms of like the bookings. Bellingham should have been booked today for the just just by virtue of the the complaining, the diving, and the fouls as well. Um, that's a yellow one. Uh, oh, you, be, you you remember your yellow card for Bernardo, do you? That's convenient. Bellingham should be booked. He should be out of the second leg. Uh, Camavinga should be definitely be booked. That's not even a question. Uh, yeah, Liam, it's very bold of you. Hey, I mean, you know, Liam, um, you do you, obviously. Um, I uh, you you know more about what you want than me, but it seems like a, it seems like a big opportunity to not do. But if you think there's a better opportunity to do, you go for it. You go for it, man. <laughs> I would proud of you whatever you do. Uh, Modric again. There's far too much space for uh, uh Carver Howe has been given uh, afforded way too much space in this game. I feel like. City just wants to punt it out. Can't win the second ball. Got to win the second ball there, lads. Because Real Madrid will shit. Real Madrid. If if it, if if any team is going to shit house their way to a to a fourth goal, it's going to be Real Madrid. Alvarez self respect. No, we still. I still want to keep Alvarez. I like Alvarez a lot. Alvarez Spanish passport says Muha. Brilliant. Let's just uh, chill out, shall we? Modric ball in. So dangerous. Such a good defensive action by John Stones, though. Brilliant. Did you actually... Did you say 3 all, Alan? Modric, dangerous ball. John Stones deals with it, though. Good. Yeah, good work by John. Uh, got to defend the corner, boys. Got to defend the corner. Corner. Into Modric. Taken short. Raheem Diaz, well blocked. Oh my god, it came back out. Well, well skied over by Carvajal. I thought I was going to do another bullshit top bins thing. How's Pernod pull, pull, pulled off a full 90 after that first half? I don't know, but to be fair, he, he's been... Since since I started shouting at him at the start of the second half, he's been a lot better. Stones can have my babies. Yeah, big up. What's the point of Holland on the pitch? Because because he, he gets he gets City in general pushed up the pitch, and because he occupies defenders, that's why. That is a why. 
madness. Six different goal scorers. Well, technically four goal scorers because one was known goal. Technically. To win the throw in or something, boys. Win the foul. Good work, Kova. Good work. But only four minutes of added time. We can chill. I believe Judge Mo will say answer two goals better than Jason. <laughs> I can't believe Mo said that, man. I can't believe Mo said that. Craziness. Craziness. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to do a post-mortem today or tomorrow morning. Because we do touchline talk nowadays, Wednesday mornings. So I might do a sort of touchline talk and post-mortem at the same time. Five added for the arse. If that's too old, that's not the best situation for them. Obviously. Yeah, I, 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 feel, I feel quite tired, guys. So I don't, I don't think I want to do... Oh, Bernardo. He didn't need to play that ball. Now I've lost it. Concavardio, back to, back to the keeper. Yeah, headers. Easy, easy. Yeah, I'll do it tomorrow morning, guys. We'll do a post-mortem and touchline talk in the same stream because I don't want to... Uh... I support Man City, Thabo. How about you, matey? I don't want to do... Uh... I don't want to do it tonight, I'll be honest. I just want to chill out. This has been an emotional game, and I just want to vibe. Don't lose it there, Jack. That's a foul. They love fouling Jack, man. They love fouling him. Oh, I see, Tom. Arsenal going to get a pen, says Liam. It's entirely possible. Saka and Arsenal are screaming that they should have a pen. Should they have a pen? Should they have a pen? Let's have a look. Uh. uh nah, isn't, isn't that just a trailing leg by Saka? I don't think they're going to give that, are they? Nah, S Saka throws his leg there, guys. He's looking for it. That was my that was my that's my assessment of that. Um anyway, back to the city game. Uh 90 seconds left. Again, guys, let's chill. Saka such a down. The way the way I looked at that, guys, I only looked at the replay a couple of times. The way I looked at that move, that looked like Saka purposefully threw his right leg out. Um, in order to draw the contact, in which case it's technically a, a, it's drawing contact, it's technically a dive. Is it? He moved his leg out of the original direction. Yeah, exactly. Like that, that, that tells me that it's a dive, and that's full time in the game. It looks like full time in the Arsenal game. There's still one minute here. City in the corner. Good. Just chill out. Try to win a corner. No, no. Oh, win a throw in. Do something. It's a throw into Real Madrid. L. L, 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 L. Thank you, Nan. Thank you. Toby, mate. No, I've watched that. You are not. That was never a penalty, Toby. Asaka swings his leg out looking for the contact. I'm sorry, Toby, but that's not a penalty, matey. I'm sorry. I know you're upset, but it's not a penalty. No, 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 no. He's, he's drawing the... Uh, he's, he's trying to draw the contact. Right, there's 20 seconds left. Can we stay tight for 20 seconds, boys? Stop the cross, Jack. You've got to stop the cross here. Didn't stop the cross. Brilliant. Okay, throw in. There we go. 10 seconds left. 10 seconds left. Why can't you show the game? That's illegal, Thabo. Oh, he's, in, he's blown full time. Get in. Big. Big. It was the pen, guys. I, I I saw Saka swing a leg. This is a great result. A great result for Man City. Make no mistake about it. What Scorpio says we should have won 3-2. And look, maybe we could have won the game. But at the end of the day, guys, especially considering that... Thank you so much for subscribing. I am Zaidzu. Thank you for becoming an Abinio. We've got to think about the, the fact that there is no... There's not going to be any true mini for the next leg. So that, that's an option for Real Madrid gone. Um, we were 2-1 down at one point. At halftime, we were 2-1 down. It was looking bleak. It was looking bleak. At home, I can see us getting the job done and getting the victory. So I'm really happy with that result. 
I'm not happy with the first half performance. Um, second half was a lot better in terms of performance. And that's not that's not just the goals. I, I won't be going to the home tie, Jason, because I don't go to the Champions League games because uh, I'm not on the Cups game. So I will be doing a watch along for that. Uh, so make sure to join me for that when it comes. Uh, I've no... Yeah, my, my main grievance with that game is I have no idea why Kamavinga wasn't injured, injured, why he wasn't booked and therefore should be missing the game. So if he does anything of any note in the uh, second leg, I'm going to be very, very annoyed. Uh, Alan, you might be, I don't know. Rio Ferdinand the Bass is pleasing as a penalty if it's going to more what? Again, from what I saw, guys, it definitely wasn't a penalty. Saka looks to draw the contact by swinging his right foot out. There's a difference between uh, being taken out and, mo and positioning yourself to be taken out. And it looked like it was the latter rather than the former for me. Yeah, m for me, guys, massive result. Really good. Happy with the draw. Obviously, a win's better, but you've got to take a draw. Real, let's, put, let's put it in perspective. Real Madrid fans will not be happy. They will not be happy with the fact that they've now got to either win at the Etihad or rely on penalties. It's very unlikely they win at the Etihad because we, we haven't lost there in Europe since Lyon in like 2019, I think. Or like 2020. It's like four or five years since we last lost in the... Maybe it's only three years. It's between... It's three or four years since we last lost at home in the... In the Champions League. Can't remember the last time we, lo we lost in a knockout game. Um, we've never lost a knockout game at home. Oh, no, never mind. Yes, we have. Liverpool. 2018. So f six years ago was the last time we lost a knockout game at home. I think that's right. Uh... Yeah, six years. So it's, it's unlikely we lose. I think a draw is a fair reflection of that game. I wasn't particularly impressed with Real Madrid, guys. As much as I've like said how I, you know, I didn't think City were that good either. I wasn't that impressed with Real Madrid. Um, I thought Bellingham was shit, quite frankly. I was expecting so much more. He was crap. Um, he, he was on the floor most of the time and complaining most of the time and diving more than actually contributing to his team's efforts. Um... Rodrigo was probably the player I was most impressed with from a um, from an offensive standpoint. In terms of the overall play, probably most impressed with Camavinga. Uh, same for, yeah, yeah, don't worry, I, I, I'm not going yet. Uh, I thought that he was really... I, I, he still should have been booked, mind. He still should have been booked. But I was... Uh, I, I, I thought I was I, I was quite impressed with him. Rudiger did good on Haaland. Converse, I think there were some duels that Haaland won there. Uh, do we need to start discussing Pep hiring a defensive coach where two is to score against terrible without ball? Well, we aren't normally. It's just for periods of the season we have. I think that that'll be rectified in the summer. For, I mean, Foden is on the Foden is on the pitch right now, walking without a limp. Like he's not down the tunnel. He's chilling. So hopefully Foden's fine. Uh, we've got a big advantage now to John, hundred percent. Um. Definitely. Uh, I lost my mouth. As Colin saying, yeah, it was crazy. It was craziness. It was craziness. And that's that's a very good point. You know, that's a very good point, to be fair, Scorpio. We did not have Kyle Walker, who is who is who has been purpose built to deal with um, uh, Vinicius Jr. Oh, <laughs> good word, Jack. Um. It, yeah, we didn't have Kyle Walker, who is purpose-built to deal with Vinicius Jr.'s uh, pace. We didn't have Nathan Ake, who is uh, 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 pro probably still shouldn't have started, but is still a very good option to have defensively if we need it. Uh, and obviously, we didn't have even the option to have Kevin. Thank you so much for uh, following Spear Dusk. You are now in Abinio. You can't ever leave. Um, yeah, we didn't even have the really the option to bring on Kevin De Bruyne because he was apparently throwing up, so you couldn't really bring... No Edison either. Very good point, John. No Edison either. So, whereas you look at Real Madrid, and they will technically be weaker going into the next game, won't it? Because they won't have Chilmany. Um. So it's a it's a good time. It's it's a it's a good time to be fair. You would like to think they wouldn't get those two really annoying deflected goals again. Um. But we shall, we shall see what we see. Yeah, big up to you. Oh, nice, nice Man City emoji. Love that from you, Spear Dusk. 
Uh, I'm sure City will win the second leg. Second game, Madrid have to be so much more clinical at home. Second leg, Walker might be back. De Bruyne's rested, so is Edison. Yes, totally agree with that. Real Madrid look bang average. All they can bring on are veterans. Uh, Real Madrid are athletic. They are very athletic. That is what is going in their favour, to be fair. These results, it should be City buying in the semis. Arsenal got a big task now. Big task. I think I think a draw, a win, no no chance, DR. No chance. Um, two deflected efforts um, and then a world-class strike. Uh, I, I'm not convinced that they deserve a win. A draw is a fair result. I think a draw is a very fair result. Uh, Jude's such a DV. Yeah, Jude was Jude was actually pathetic, man. I'm just I'm I'm disappointed. I'm really disappointed in his performance and his mentality. Um, yeah, I, I thought it was embarrassing. City wanted a draw. Yeah, good. I'm really happy with a draw. I'm well happy with a draw. Golden mistake. Yeah, well, m m m mistakes are a part of a football, aren't they? Uh, luck is luck. And again, I think on balance of play, if you think Real Madrid deserve to win that game, I I I don't know what to say. Um, a draw a draw is a very reasonable result. Jordan did it. De Bruyne being weak says how brilliant. Cavadio man match. I think he might be onto something there, Cold, because he was ridiculously good. He was ridiculously good. Uh, we have Luton while Arsenal Villa. Then they are going to get hammered at the Allianz. You'd like to think so. You'd like to think so, and yet I don't know. Uh, thank you so much for following uh, uh, Serp. Serp uh, rank. Uh, thanks. If, if you aren't already following or subscribed, what are you doing, guys? Make sure to follow or subscribe right now. Do it, I reckon. Do it. Um, yeah, it's a thing. Um, guys. Oh, Stones, man, the match is broccoli. Yeah. So, yeah, Stones, Stones was all right. It wasn't a vintage Stones performance. I thought it was good. But again, a couple of times where he gave away the ball in a silly way. Gavardio was crazy. He was crazy. Whoever comes out this side of the draw wins it all. They should do. I mean, this side of the draw is significantly stronger than the other side. Uh, significantly stronger. Um, no disrespect to Bars. Well, a bit, bit, bit of disrespect to Bars of PSG. They're a bit crap, aren't they? <laughs> but um, Atletico are probably the best side on that side. Uh, yeah, big up to you. Uh, thank you, mate. Are you a Chelsea fan? I think you are. Lovely stuff. Um, <laughs> now and on. Uh, Stuttgart, a time of buying in points. That's crazy. Yoshko, man. Of the yeah, guys, get your, get your man of the match in now, guys. Who do you think should be man of the match? Who should be man of the match? Uh, I don't trust Tuchel. He's breaking all of Bayern records, but not positive ones. Yeah, he's uh he's going through it at the moment, isn't he? He's going through it. By the way, he's got. By the way, guys, we've got over a hundred people watching on a watch along. Uh, we don't normally have these numbers for the YouTube watch alongs normally, so for our post mortem analysis stuff. So thank you guys for joining me. If you are new, please make sure to subscribe to the channel. And make sure to leave a like on the stream. It well, it does really help. Um. When you force my phone to coffee, you know, you're not wrong, to be fair. You are not wrong, to be fair. Uh, Yoshko, man of the match for Scorpio. Uh, Rob says, um, okay, Rob, love that from you. Gavardio is man of the match. Uh, Kieran says Yoshko. For me, it's Gavardio as well, guys. Prince Smith says Yoshko as well. Yoshko. Uh, Yoshko. Johnny Boulders. Holland. Interesting shout. Uh, Gavardio did Holland's job. Uh, are you happy with the draw? I'm buzzing with a draw, mate. Buzzing with a draw. You've got, you've got to... You've got to look at these knockout games in in terms of the whole. You know, you know, you know um, we didn't win at the Bernabeu last season, but we didn't need to because we knew we could do well. We, we knew we we knew we could do well at home. It's a similar thing uh, in, uh, against Bayern. Uh, we, we, uh, I think we drew that game, didn't we? Because um, that, that was in the second leg. But again, we didn't need to win it because the, the damage was done at home. And we're in a real. If that if this was the draw at home, I'd be very upset. I'd be very upset and angry because the Bernabeu, Real Madrid, Champions League, voodoo, eh, voodoo, whatever you want to call it, uh, anything can happen. But it's at the Etihad, and we don't really lose at the Etihad, especially in Europe. I haven't lost a knockout game in Europe for six years. Uh, so we've put ourselves in a fantastic position. Yeah, DR, I don't think you're wrong. I'm just having a look at it now. 
I know what Holland was doing in that game. He was holding up play. He was taking Rude ground to the game. He was drawing fouls. Rodri made some mistakes, yes, but he he also made some good moments. I can't really think if Bellingham did anything. As I say, apart from cry a lot, he actually may have been the worst. That's crazy. The, the apparent Ballon d'Or winner was the worst player on the pitch. That's crazy. It didn't even offer anything. Crazy. Love you. Thank you, Shadow Viper, for subscribing. Love your profile picture. Gavardio was man of the match, not because of the goal. Yeah, the goal, the goal is just the cherry on top. The goal is the cherry on top. Exactly, Adnan. Now it's, now it's in our hands in the Etihad crowd. And, you know, Real Madrid fans notoriously aren't the best in terms of traveling either or away support. So that whole we're going to close the roof and everyone's going to wear white. It's going to be a packed stadium. The lure, that did shit all, thankfully. Uh, and we know how good the Etihad is on those European nights. Certainly, if any, if last season's got uh, anything to go off. Why was so reluctant to pass through Boston Hall and uh, says Kira? I don't know. There was this really good moment where Foden. I know he scored the goal. He had to slip in Hall and in, in that one moment he went for goal himself and it was a bit nothing. Jude sucks today. I agree. He's generally fantastic, but poor. This is first time I've seen firsthand how jammy Madrid aren't. No, yeah, I know, Rob. I've watched a bit of Madrid this season, particularly at the start, and yeah, it was a similar similar vibe. Yeah, we're not at Bayern last year, 100%. And Mars, I don't like away goals. I'm glad we got rid of them. I've never understood away goals, ever. They did. They closed the roof to get a draw, yes. Um, uh, Real can't beat City at their place with a weakened team, 100%. Is Phil Foden okay, says Legend? Hopefully, yes. Um, it appeared that... Um, it appeared that... Uh, he, he, he seemed... He, I know he came off, but it's, it, I'm hoping it looked more like an impact injury rather than anything else. He seemed to be walking around the pitch afterwards, okay? Like he wasn't down the tunnel getting treatments or anything. He was he was walking pretty fine, so hopefully it's fine. Uh, Courtois will not be back, no. Uh, Stones made at least two goals. Yes, yeah, st yeah, Stones was. Good defensively. Just on the ball, I had a few concerns. Jack Grealish, unreal. My second match. That left side of Gavardiol and Grealish is sick. If we're playing like the John Stone system, I, I love Ake, obviously, but Gavardio Grealish is, is just so good, man. And yeah, Gavardio's not as good defensively 1v1, but he's not bad. Do you, he, he locked up Saka, in fairness. He, did, he didn't struggle today against a, a Real Madrid side where Vinicius sometimes went to the right and Bellingham and Rodrigo. He's like, his, his defensive work has been over, his defensive like badness or whatever has been overstated. Toby, the, the overall XG was what, 1.6? No, 1.46. Yeah, because Real Madrid scored 3 from 0 0.63. We scored 3 from 0 0.83. Mad. Absolutely mad. He's out for the whole season, isn't he? Uh, will we finally get a hole and goal assist against Madrid? He he didn't get one last season, but he, did, he was exceptional last season, particularly in the Etihad. He was unbelievable last season at the Etihad. Let's hope for another one. Um, Kanji handled the Brazilians. Yeah, I thought Kanji was great. Uh, Jack Gris also has a good shot for man of the match. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I think the goal for Gavardio will push him over the edge, but he was class. He was class. Other than the one goal scored against us, Jude has never made an impact. That's a good point, actually. Um, is that the first game where Bellingham's not scored against us? I feel like he always scored against us when he was at Dortmund. Um, who wouldn't mind the match officially? Uh, I actually don't know. I wasn't paying attention. Fort Mob's given it to Vinicius because he got two assists. I couldn't. I, I would not have been able to tell you he got two assists. I know he got the first one, but yeah, I didn't realize he, he got the assist for the third. Yeah, Modric is one of those. You got to met, you got to utilize his minutes. Guys having a sleeper season. I, I, Rob, yeah, he's been fantastic. And people who don't watch City decide he's been bad. He's been he's been brilliant. Doku at the Etihad, Adnan. I I want us to set up the exact same way. Maybe just having um. You know, De Bruyne instead of Kovacic, but maybe. But I wouldn't be against seeing that team again. And if Walker's available, maybe Walker, because purely to deal with Vinicius. Uh, we'll look at today, says Mark. Um, I don't know if I agree. I don't think we were lucky. I think that. If anything, we were unlucky, certainly for that first goal. Um, no, I, 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 think, I think a draw, I think a draw is a very fair result. I think a draw was a very, very fair result. Not sure, I'm not sure I agree, I, I agree with that. 
Foden got man of the match. Big up. I mean, the power of a goal. Just on Foden, I don't think he played that well. First half, not great. Second half, better. Still not great, but he scored a goal. That's what your best players do. And pe people, I really hope now people are catching on to the facts that, because I've seen a lot of people say it, like on Twitter especially, um, Foden isn't the difference maker. Foden isn't that guy. But that's literally what he's been this season. That's what he is. You're losing at the Bernabeu. You need a goal desperately. Upsets Phil Foden. You need to go in the Manchester derby because you're losing. Upsets Phil Foden. You need to go in the Manchester derby because you're drawing. Upsets Phil Foden. Uh, even like at, at Anfield in like the title running a couple of years ago. You need to go to Anfield. Boom. Upsets Phil Foden. This guy's always good. This guy's big game goal catalogue is unreal. Uh... That wasn't looked at. Yeah, 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 uh, exactly. A Jew scored in one of... Wait, only one? Is Are you sure about that, Jack? I'm sure he scored in at least two. The first time... The, the time he met them in the knockouts and then the group stages. Are you sure about that, Jack? Uh, come on, Palace is United. They're both brilliant. Hello, Elder, mate. A phone did a Salah play ship, but scored a banger. Exactly, Elder. And hey, sometimes... If you're scoring bangers, then it doesn't really matter, does it? Um, do you think Holland did enough off the ball? Um, I think he could have done more, but at the same time, uh, it's tricky when Rudiger is just absolutely trying to man mark you and he's incredibly aggressive. Thought he was lucky to escape a yellow card at times. And if Holland's occupying Rudiger, that means there's one defender who's not in the game. Drew scoring more than one because he scored. I'm, uh, are you sure about this, mate? I'm convinced that he scored in, a, in the 2020-21 season when we got to the final loss against Chelsea. And I'm convinced he scored against us in the group stages last season. Like it went off his back or something. Are we sure that he's only scored one? I'm convinced there's at least two. I'm convinced. Uh, phone inside the box shooting is getting ridiculous. It's good. It is. He's a threat. He's a threat. Rodri's on the unbeaten run, 100%. He scored the headed goal. It is two. Yeah, you guys are frauds, man. No cap. You guys are fraudsters. Absolute swines and frauds. Um, craziness. Who do you think is going to win? What? The, uh, the, the, the this tie, it will be... I ca I ca th there's no world in which I can predict us to lose at the Etihad. The only way we... I'm, I'm so convinced. The only way we lose at the Etihad is if we lose on penalties. Because I can't see us losing over 90 minutes or 120 minutes. I can't see that. Are we streaming tomorrow? Yes, mate. We'll be we'll be live tomorrow as well. Um, yeah, uh, yeah. Yes, we will. So make sure to pop your notifications on if you haven't already done so. Uh, PM and Arsenal and Bayern. So I didn't watch the game, obviously, because I was watching uh, that. Yeah, I'll do the schedule. Yeah, I'll 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 just I'll, I'll just stream. I wasn't going to stream because I've not been feeling great in like the past few weeks because like stuff's going on. But I, I will. Uh, I think the FA has got to look into it. I think, irrespective of him having a yellow card, he should be banned for a long time because that was the most dangerous thing I've seen in a football field for many, many years. <laughs> That's a really good use My of that My boys one, could have been killed by Camavinga. Very good use of that, whoever that was. Uh, what are your thoughts on the new Fergie uh, one, by the way? Phone fine. Yeah, phone looked fine. Yeah, we'll be, yeah, we'll be live tomorrow. Uh, we'll go tomorrow morning. Good work, Scorpio. We'll, we'll be live tomorrow morning for... I don't know if I... No, I, w I won't do a post-mortem tonight... What we'll do is we'll do a we'll do a touchline talk slash post mortem of today's game tomorrow morning at eleven o'clock. So normally we we'll do Wednesday touchline talk Wednesday eleven a.m. Uh, so we'll do the post mortem then. Uh, why is Hassam texting me? Why? Right, this guy, this guy always act gives me times and asks me to do times I cannot do. He's such a fraud. I swear, man. Hello, uh, Senior Lucas. Real Madrid must be the only team in the world that can score three goals against Guardiola City. Um, uh, have we... Have we? No, uh, well, Poch, unless his name is Pochettino. Four goals. Uh, Leverkusen, West Ham on Thursday. Big up. Uh, Prince Smith Perez is so terrified of City he decides to build a separate league to avoid competition. <laughs> Sam's a Liverpool, Liverpool fan, content creator. All three goals outside the box. Uh, yeah, the, the the quality of the goals is crazy. Um, what? Wait, were all six goals outside the box? The the Bernardo's was. Uh, oh no, Rodrigo's wasn't. That was inside the box. 
But uh, technically, Camavinga shot was outside the box. I know it deflects off Diaz, who I think was in the box. But so that's five out of six goals from outside the box. That's that's mad. Time for yeah, the, the non-existent roof. Yeah, exactly. Uh, was it not Jack? Was, was it not just? Or was it just inside it? I thought in my head it was just on the edge. Okay, fair enough. Fair, fair, fair. Uh, Ala Madrid uh, says Zin. It's not looking good currently. Yeah, two inside. Okay, so four out. That's still a high amount. To be fair, four outside the box is a little bit mad. A little bit mad. In my head, it was just outside, but if you guys are saying it was just inside, that's chill. Uh, on goal was outside. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, madness. Uh, guys, I mean, uh, look, check right now. Check right now for everyone in the chat here. Happy, yes or no? Whether you're a City fan or not, yeah, are, are you happy with that result, ultimately, with the knowledge that next week or the week after, whenever it is, if we win at the Etihad, we go through? Obviously. Are you happy with that? I am personally very happy with it as a City fan. I'm very, very happy with it. Uh, Shadow Viper is happy. Doug is happy. Scorpio is happy. I don't like we were the last to concede. True, Scorpio, true. Uh, Tony says delighted. Uh, I think if De Bruyne's available, Rich, you've got... And he was going to start today. It was just because he was ill. Uh, G is happy. I love that from you, DR. Uh, I am content. Oh, oh I'm content. Okay, okay Jack. Uh, couldn't be happy unless we won, says Colin. Yeah, guys, I, I'm, I'm really happy to us. Again, obviously, a win would be better, but you've got to temper expectations, I feel like. Um, Hugh is happy. Dean is happy. Uh, DM's not happy. Totally twice and came away with a draw. But we did also come back from being 2-1 down, and we scored three goals at the Bernabeu. Nothing you can do about the last goal, says John. Yeah, Jamie says you got to be... Uh, uh, for me, I think you've got to be happy. Very happy. Uh, playing poor. And that's that's a good point, to be fair. We were not good today. I, 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 and Real Madrid were not good today either. Um, so, of course, that there's a chance for Real Madrid to be better. But the chances of Real Madrid being better at the Etihad are less likely than City being better at the Etihad. Um, again, Real Madrid will actually have less key players than today because there were no each room in There shouldn't be any Camavinga either. He should have been booked, but whatever. Bellingham should have been booked for crying all the time, but whatever. Whereas City will have, hopefully, a well Kyle Walker, maybe. Maybe Ake. Certainly De Bruyne. I don't know enough about the Walker-Ake situation, but maybe they'll be available too. Doom's definitely happy as a City fan. Wish we could have kept it 3-2. But we were losing. Yeah, again, I, I look at it as, what were you happy with pre-kickoff? I, I would have been... If you said, right, a draw? Yes. Take that 100%. Bite your arm off that, definitely. Uh, Sponge is happy with it. The result confirms our form is on the up. If we got a defence back, we could win at the Etihad. Totally. And Mbappe masterclass in the final says DR. I'd be very impressed if they got past the semi-finals. Hello, Musty. Uh, took advantage of Bernardo and Rodri playing like ass. Yeah, and look, what what are the chances that Bernardo and Rodri are going to play like booty for like 60 minutes? Again, it's very unlikely. It was an emotional roller coaster, Musty, that's for sure. Uh, first half rubbish, second half very good. I'd say it's sort of like last... 35-ish minutes I was happy with. So I wasn't happy with the opening exchanges of the second half. We are missing key, key players. But, they, but but De Bruyne will be back. De Bruyne will be back. Uh, we upped the tempo. Yeah, that, that, that was around when I was happy with it as well. It was... It was I'll tell you, I tell you what, the, uh, what the catalyst may have been. Do you guys remember that, that Foden shot where he cut inside and eventually it just like went straight down the... Throat of a uh, uh, Lunin, Lo Lo the, the keeper. But that was so much better. That was so much better. And I was like, right, let's just keep doing that. Let's just keep taking long shots because they're backing off so much. And like five, ten minutes later, boom. Phil Foden outside the box. A few minutes after that, boom. Gavardiel outside the box. Because they were just affording us all that space. So why not just go for it? Milito will be, he'll, he'll be back. He will, but Diar, you know, why didn't he play tonight is my question to you. Stones box Bellingham. Yeah, again, Bellingham was bad today. He was arguably the worst player on the pitch. Um, yeah, terrible. Phil Foden, hold that. Bellingham, hold that. PSG getting him out. Say it's how I die. Big up, Pravash. I want to watch Valverde more. I don't know where he came from. Uh, Vinny was going to pick Brahim Diaz, but it was good run by Valverde. Yeah, definitely. Uh, second half, we took control of the game. Yeah, we did. Back from injury. Well, it's not. Well, he'll be rusty then. Yeah, he'll be rusty. Yeah. 
Uh, staff is worried about worried about Rodri. Yeah, that, that is two games on the bounce now where it's not been great from him. It's not been great. Hopefully, I, we play Luton next. I have no idea if he's going to get rested for the Luton game because Luton aren't a bad team, man. Luton aren't a bad team. But maybe, do you look at the game and go, can we can we afford to give him a little bit of a rest if there is a fitness issue? I don't know if there is. Maybe it's just a bad game. Maybe we're just using that as an excuse. Maybe, maybe he's actually at fine. Uh, the next... Isn't the next leg next week? Is that right? Is that right? I don't know. Let's find out. Let's find out together. We'll find out when the next game is, boys. I'm pretty sure it's next week, though. I'm pretty sure. Um, Let's have a look. Fixtures. Yes. Next week. Next Wednesday. Luton on Saturday. Real Madrid on Wednesday. Uh, lovely stuff. Uh, love that from you, Niall. DR, mate, can you do me a favor? Can you create a Discord invite and pop it in the YouTube chat? Guys, if you're in the, if you're in the YouTube chat, um, come join our Discord server if you would like to. You can speak to me in there if you want. Every day, sometimes. Madrid goals came from the wings. They don't have a serious striker. They don't, uh, yeah, well, they don't have, they've got, they, 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 they play a weird system because they don't really have any, as you say, proper strikers. So they've got to, uh, got to play wingers as strikers. It's weird. Uh, they were playing like Everton two path, and then we took our chances. I mean, some of the defending was was mad from them. Uh, how serious was the Foden injury? He should get a rest, says uh, Schaff. If he's able to be given a rest, then yeah, that's fine. Uh, I'm hoping it's not a bad injury. He was walking around on the pitch afterwards. I'm hoping it was just impact and precautionary taking him off. I don't know. About, I don't know about Foden yet. I'm gonna wait. Actually, I'm gonna stay alive until like the the the, the Guardiola interview because hopefully they will ask. Him about that i'm not going madrid i'll be here streaming it guys i'm not on the i'm not on the cup scheme just so a massive can never miss in the 90th minute says john crazy bones have two weeks you can hold that uh pep believes oh dr you're not a mod uh how do i do that one sec guys uh uh there you go, DR. I think I've done it, mate. Boom. Never. No, it's never a pen. Never a pen. Never a pen. No shot. Uh, Bowen out for two weeks. Uh, who do they play? Do they play like Liverpool? Guys, if you want to join our Discord server, or again, you can chat to me like every day or whatever. Click that link there. We're just going to... They're just doing the interview with Pep. So wait and see, guys, because we might be getting an update on Phil Foden's injury situation. I'm just going to see if I can tune into this. Don't go anywhere. We're going to find out now. If Pep... Surely they'll ask him about it. Uh, UEFA and quarters at the same time. Come on now, says Greg. Yeah, I was really happy with the, with the, uh, really happy with the results at the end of the day. Come on, Pep. Tell us about Foden. What's the injury situation? Uh, love that from you, Rich. Yeah, make sure you're following if you haven't already done so. Yeah, Pep, that's that's fine telling us about the results, but what about little Phil? What's going on? Is he injured? Yes or no? Yeah, he, 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 Pep's basically echoing what we said. Uh, much more composure. Uh, in the uh in the second half compared to the first, which I agree with. We definitely lost the ball less. We'll have that support, don't you worry, mate. It's always good. Uh, in these Champions League nights. I can't show the interview domes. No, that'll be illegal. Oh, they're still talking about the, the deflections. Uh, well, it's currently on TNT Sports. Respect the YouTube chat, I reckon. Kravage just made his first switch was bad. Really? I thought it was pretty good. Well, either way, he absolutely popped off. He'll be okay after a few days, says Tony. I hope you're right, mate. Double treble. I don't care what he asked about. Uh, interviewer? Tell us, sorry, ask about Phil. Ask about the fitness of Phil Foden, please. Come on now. I should be an interviewer, guys. I know the questions that need to be asked. Grealish was unbelievable, Tony. My next analysis video is going to be on why Jack Grealish is sick. Because he's been brilliant. The brilliant against Villa. Brilliant against Palace. Good when he came on against Arsenal. Good against Real Madrid. Unreal, this guy. All four goals against fucking Palace. Give him the left. He's talking about Gavardio now. Yeah, by the way, you guys, shout out to, um, 
shout out to Gavardio because there were question marks about his fitness and he just absolutely pops off at the Bernabeu. Yeah, Pep's my boy, man. Got, ex by the way, guys, exclamation mark poster in the... Oh, there we go. Okay, he's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Apparently Phil, Phil didn't even really want to come off. It's all good. It's chill. All good. Foden, injury, not an issue. Fine, beautiful work, as we suspected. Lovely, lovely. Uh, good. That's all I wanted to know. I'm a happy, I'm a happy boy now. Phil Foden is fine. Uh, yeah, exactly. That's the one. He, he's all good. He's all good. Lovely. Uh... <laughs> Good stuff. That's that is fantastic news on Phil Foden. So we go there without any uh any fresh injury concerns. Uh, wonderful work. I'm really happy with that. Um, Bellingham's now saying he doesn't like the refereeing. Is he is he fucking serious? He's such a little bitch boy. What a fucking pro. What a fucking bitch. What a twat, man. Like shut up, dude. Get get over yourself. For such a huge club, I'll be honest, Madrid. It's just as pointed to me how they play end long balls and hope to catch them off guard. Expect more from these places. Chris. Uh, that's how you gotta play against City sometimes, to be fair. This draw feels like a defeat we wanted to win. Well, and of course, yeah, of course. You're at the Bernabeu. You probably need to win. S chances are you're not gonna win at the Etihad. They might. I'm not saying they won't, but it's clearly more likely they won't win than they will. So it's it's a big it'll be a big disappointment for them, yeah. Bellingham was bad. It was more than quite, it was just bad. Uh I think it's Holmo. But there was a there was a moment where phone should have slipped him in, to be fair. I will say that. Betting on trip. I agree, Shaf. I agree. I've no I I've no idea how Camavinga escaped to yellow. I've no idea how Bellingham escaped to yellow as well. I'm I'm staggered. The, the fouls, the complaining, the diving, the antics. It, it was just in, it was just like I didn't know what I didn't know what I was watching, to be honest. It, it's it's not the Bellingham that I see when he's playing for England. I I will say that much in terms of like his attitude. He does not dive and roll around on the floor like that. So it's clearly it's clearly like a uh, clearly been instructed to do that. It's just just so petty and pathetic. That's the first thing you go to when they don't win. The refs, yes, stupid. So I've had two weeks with, uh, sorry, is that uh, Jared Bowen? Hello, Jurgen. How are how, how are we, cheeky? Yeah, I just thought that was pathetic. That is in, that is indeed Gvardiol's first goal for City. <sighs> Brilliant stuff, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. I'm going to head off now. Uh, it's ten thirty. Uh, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. If you haven't already, subscribe, like the video. I'll be back tomorrow morning at 11. We're going to be doing a post-mortem of the Real Madrid City game. And we are going to be... Um, and we are going to be uh, also just like t t t touching on some other topics because it's technically touchline talk. Uh, so that is what we will be doing. Don't go anywhere for a second though, guys. Don't go anywhere. Um, because... I'm telling you to stay here for just for a second, just for a second, just while I sort some admin out. Uh, da, 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 da. Una momento. Talk amongst yourselves, guys. Oh, in fact, last thing before before I go, guys. Don't, as I say, don't go anywhere yet. Um, final. What what is the score going to be at the Etihad? What is the score going to be at the Etihad, guys? What do you think? What do you think? I'm going to go 2-1 to Man City. That's what I'm going to go. I don't think we'll keep a clean sheet, but I do think that, uh, I do think we'll get the win. That's what I'm going to go. Oh, yeah, phone speaking, phone looks fine. 3-2 City, love that. Yeah, yeah, phone's fine, it's not injured, it's all good. 4-1, uh, ma massive. 2-0 City, 3-1 says Kushik, 3-1 says Staffy. Love that. Uh, evening, love that. Yeah, Fox, brilliant. 3 2, uh, 2 0 or 2 1 to City, lovely stuff. Guys, thank you so much for joining me. Stay on the channel because this is going to redirect you to LB's uh, second channel where he's currently doing his player ratings. Let him know that Nobbins sent you. Um, uh, and I will see you all tomorrow at 11 a.m. So go tell LB and Nobbins sent you. Goodbye, guys. Come on, City.